Buona sera. Happy Manic Monday to all our rock star listeners and viewers. Zazradio.com proudly presents Stripped Live Raw Radio Interactive Talk Show starring Lenny and Lucia. Go, Go with, with the, the flow, flow. Anything, anything goes. goes. What's up, baby? What's going on? What are you doing? How are you? Oh, <laughs> what a hot, humid day. But yeah, guess it's, what? It's been hot and humid for days. It's so. Manic Monday. Yep. And here comes our rock star listeners and viewers. Yes, let's see. Let's shout out some people. Get ready. Our beautiful April Trombino. Always in the house. Okay, Joe Pastori. Here he comes. <laughs> we're, in red. we're in red tonight. Well, yeah, we're, we're a little That's hot it. tonight. A little hot. Hold on. Hot like the weather. <laughs> hot and humid like the weather is hot right. Hot and humid. But what a great so, weekend. Yeah. It's a little crazy weekend, though. Crazy weekend. Fun week. Long weekend. Long weekend. Right. But filled with happiness. And cheer, <laughs> and just just a lot of um, good moments. Yes, you know, Starting one for off. us, one one for us, most definitely was uh, Fourth of July. Fourth of July. We actually spent our first Fourth yes, of July together. First of July that was really together. awesome. That really was awesome. So that's really good. Very very fortunate for that, and um, talk about it. I mean. It was really nice to be on the water and see the fireworks like that mm -hmm. close. It was mm -hmm. really nice. And to spend it with you, of course. Well, thank you. And I mean, let's be honest. You were my assistant. Yes. We were, we were yes. more of a... I was, hold on. Not my assistant. She was like my partner in crime. My partner in crime. I mean, she... I don't know how to say anything, she was You up, got me working a lot. Yeah. <laughs> it's not enough. I'm, I have a job. Now I have to work with you, too. Well, you know, it's the fun work. You know, uh, it's the yeah. outlet, it you know. Fun. I get it, to dance. You get the dance. Way. You get to, yeah. you know, rile up the whole crowd and everything else. So uh, it was really awesome time. City of Yonkers Mayor Mike Spano brought back the fireworks, the Yonkers, you know, downtown Yonkers waterfront. Uh, and did an amazing job. It, was, it, was it really was awesome. The spectacular <laughs> firework show. Um, and of course, shout out to so Yonkers Mayor Mike Spano. Shout out to Yonkers Downtown Waterfront Bid. Also, okay. um, MGM Resorts. And who else? Generation Yonkers. So a lot of awesome people yeah. put that together. Police, fire. A lot of work. DPW, Parks, everybody had everything under control, cleaned it up awesome, and everybody had a good time. Of course, we rocked the house. That's it. We rocked the house, baby. We had Frankie Hudak in the house. house. Yeah. On the mic, and I was and doing the cha -cha slide yeah. with the crowd. That's right. We were crowd pumping. <laughs> yeah, we had a good time. It, it really fun. was a it lot was of fun. fun. So that's fun. what it's all about, you know, and that's how we do it that's from Zazradio.com, the ultimate internet. Smash up dance radio station right. and Rockstar listener in the world. Experience in the world. Oh, I don't sorry. understand it. <laughs> you don't get an intro. I just don't understand it. All right. How many times? <laughs> the same thing with with the job prior. You know, doing okay. the job prior on, on what Saturday. Did I, do? I didn't do anything wrong. You said the same thing. Rock, All right, leave me alone. Rockstar ex uh, listener because in the world. I got that in my head. Experience, Experience. mod on the main. All right. Okay, all fine. Right, That's right. okay. Everybody, right. share okay. what's going on, everybody. We some new listeners. I don't know. Cool stuff. Cool stuff. Okay, let's see who's here. What's up, Rocco? What's up, Tia? See, Joseph. Oh, our poor Tia. Manny. She, John, she, Jerry, Josephine, and Dawn. What's I don't want to. I don't want to bring down the mood, but shout out to Tia's um, daughter's friend who passed away. Uh, oh Jade. My God. Jade. Yeah. Uh, drunk driver so not to you know our oh our God. sincere condolences so uh, go out to you um and the family of course so jade's sad. family oh my God. um and uh i lost a, a friend yeah 20 22 years yeah old. we don't want to bring the mode down Same and thing. also we we want to make well, sure she was drunk 
Gronk and she smashed right into the L. Oh my God, we don't want to talk about yeah. that. We don't so talk I'm about sorry. That. All right. But um, because right. this, yeah. of course, is an outlet for yes, everybody. Definitely. And all the craziness, you know, in the world out there, you know, um, and we want this to be an outlet. So we want you to grab the glass of vino, <laughs> shake up that. Martini. Martini. Grab that beer from Yonkers Brewing Company. John Rubo. That's it. That's, Got that right. She's getting it. She's getting it. I got some things right. And we want you to bring yourself. Yes. We want you to relax. We want you to bring yourselves into Strip Live Raw Radio Interactive Talk Show. Starring Lenny and Lucia. Go with the flow. Anything goes. Hey, bro. There you are. And we want you just to chill. For two hours, not one, but two hours. Yeah, 7 p.m. Yeah, to 9 p.m. Maybe you could every Monday. <laughs> every Monday on Facebook Live. Well, we keep it pretty so, interesting. Yeah, we do. So let's. We, so, we, we try to. So talk about uh, our job. Saturday? Oh, my. Saturday was a little <laughs> bit Very crazy, funny. So we get a, so we get a last call. Another day I have to work with Lenny. So we get a call from um, <laughs> Ophelia. So we thank you yes. so much, Ophelia. Yes, thank you for we the We had wine. such a great time this until, so <laughs> until we won't say the place, but we think we met the crazy lady's sister from, from Larita Winery. <laughs> oh, my oh, God. I'm how just going to turn off this. How crazy was that? Yes. Oh that my God. Was definitely throw mama from the train, train. sister yeah. or something. I that, don't know. She was a little crazy. That was that was and a little then, fun. Get out! Get out! Flicking the lights on. Get out! Get out! Crazy. <laughs> this is crazy. our this is our place. Okay, that's it. Let's go. You you need you don't need to say anything more. In thirty years, I never ever doubt this. That so was it was crazy. really but, really funny. But we always make. The best, the best of, of every situation, and certainly we did. True. So we want to mention a couple of things. So Friday is, um, this Friday. Is oh, yes. Derek Florin is throwing a big party at Aura yes. in Long Island. Yes. And he has a couple of DJs there, right? I believe he has uh, DJ Slice and DOS. Okay. Uh, so we want to shout um, Derek Florin. From Long Island party people, Lucas Florin, nice. Elliot Florin, Robin Florin, nice. Megan Florin. Uh, we want you guys to get your tickets now. Go to see Derek Florin. And this is going to be an awesome uh, event on Friday, so check it out. And on Saturday, Saturday is MyBrooklynBrand.com, Willie DeMeo, Michelle Francesco's Entertainment brings you My Brooklyn Brand cool. Block Party. In Brooklyn, of course. Yeah, of course. And they're also celebrating Vinnie Pastor's his birthday. Okay. So it's, it's really cool. cool. Of course, Vinnie Pastor was Big Pussy from The Sopranos. Yes. If anybody doesn't know. And Vinnie Pastor is an actor. And really nice guy. Really true, awesome friend. So everybody, definitely come to that. Of course, MCG2 will be in the house. Yeah. DJ Ross the Boss will be on the ones and twos. I'll be <laughs> around. Definitely doing my, doing our things, It'll and of course, ZazRadio.com will be in the house as well. So, of course, we have MCG2 and DJ Ross the Boss. Shout out to WiseGuyWear.com. Of course, like I said, I'm yes. wearing it, the I'm clone. Wearing a clone, yeah. And then Wise Girl Wear, which everybody's raving about, and T will tell you it's unbelievable. It really is an awesome scent. So yes. I have to actually. I'm, I'm no, wait a minute. We're talking about Wise Girl Wear, oh, babe. Pay attention! Oh, it smells good Pay on attention! You. Are the blonde highlights coming through? Stop Come on it. now, really? Stop it. So wise no. guy wear it and wise girl wear. It. Let me talk, phenomena. So here we go. So and then Chris DeMeo, Willie's son, has a entire company, A T T I R E, okay. which is I'm gonna I'm gonna give it a shot. Met Metanoia, M E T A N O I A. And it's about faith in God. Oh, okay. And so go okay. go to M E T A N O I A A T T I R E dot com. Okay. Check it out. Really cool. Check it out. Um, and I think that's basically it. so shout out to Michael yes. Lewis, Anthony Asante, Nick Del Rey, Michelle Francesco's, Nick Francesco's, uh, Jersey Jerry, uh, Jersey Jerry, Pamela Roth, and 
Peter Gordio and all nice. our Brooklyn friends. And uh, Joanne Bachetta. What's up, Joanne Bachetta? Let's see. Here? What is it all about? Absolutely. Positive vibes. Positive vibes, everybody. <laughs> there it is. And love for all. Yes. Okay. Right. Let me see if I missed anybody. Um, Good. Shout them out, baby. What's up, Vita? Got me working, Babe, even on the show. Look who's here. Who? Lucia loves in the house. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> oh, you're so silly. All right, so let me shout out. Joe Pastor, Gina, Robert Hawk, Michelle Rivera, Tia Maria Montemuro. Tia, we love oh, you, yeah. and we hope your mom has yes. a very speedy recovery. Oh, yes, I hope your mom feels yeah, better. Yeah, we hope um, she feels better. She took a, a bad fall. She hurt her hip and actually had to have surgery. So our best to Tia, her mom, and family. We love you guys. Denise Joseph, and also Joe Mock, uh, Yonkers Police Department's Joe Mock, um, his father. So we we wish them um, a speedy recovery, uh, Tia's mom and yeah, Joe Mock's father. Joey Gato, Mini Tradito. Wow, Lucia, those are some ample wine glasses. Yeah, that's uh, ample wine glasses. John Sperlin, Jerry. <laughs> Debbie McLaughlin, shout out to Liam, Debbie, Ryan, Michelle DeMeo, what's up? Michelle DeMeo and Jerry DeMeo, Josephine Baker, Dawn, Tammy, yes. Lou, Peter Timlin, April Trombino, <laughs> Tammy, everybody share, Tiffany, share, share, share. Vita, what's up, Vita? Uh, let's see, Jackie, Vinny Finnegan. And, oh, my God, how awesome was that? Um, the Spano 4th of July picture. That was so awesome. Oh, that, wow, that's a lot of... Yeah, it's a lot of grandchildren. There's a yes. lot of nephews and nieces yes. and brothers and sisters. That's a lot. That was such an awesome picture, guys. I love that. <laughs> and next year, Lucia and I will be celebrating with you guys down in Mastic. Oh, I love you guys. Joe Benora. Angela, Jean DiNapoli. Oh, we have to shout out Jean DiNapoli. Uncle Louie Variety Show is coming. Jean, put the date. Uh, so ecstatic about that. Our friends, Carlo Russo and Uncle Louie, Lou Greco, yes. and Tony Napoli Events. I believe it is. Nice. I believe it is August 24th, is it? Let me know because okay. put it down. Carmelo Venuto. And, of course, Frankie Hudak's in the house. Frankie. Thank you. So, we're both wearing red tonight. Yeah, with a little... Love's in the air. Love's in the air. Oh, <laughs> love's in the air. Oh, yeah. We can. You don't want to hear me sing. But don't forget, guys, every Monday through Friday, 9 to 5, our flashback work mix yes. on ZazRadio.com. Like and share it. And... You hear uh, new school freestyle artist Magicus, his manager um, Richard De Prima will be in the house also at the Brooklyn Block, Block Party. So uh, listen to his amazing music. Um, we have his stuff on our platform. We also have Angela Venuto, Maria Elena Venuto, um, Vinnie Maduno. We have some really and Amy Fortagione. <laughs> we have some really awesome. You know, cool. we want to incorporate some. You know, some other people and give them a shot, you know, on our platform right. so we can blast them out, you know. Okay. And then it works both ways, so it's really nice, you know. It's all about friends supporting friends, remember that. So Definitely. check out our flashback work mix, dance classics and freestyle, Monday through Friday, nine to five. All right, baby. Okay. Tommy Smooth, what's up? Tommy Smooth. Did you guys see Tommy Smooth and Anthony DiDio's show last night? Oh. Wow. It was awesome. We caught the last of it, but guess yes, what? Yes. Wow. Sundays are tough. Sundays 8 p.m., but that's okay. Tough. Listen, mm -hmm. we can't wait to uh, check you guys out when you get back because we're going to be taking a trip yes. to New Jersey. Yes. We're dirty Jersey. Jersey. We always say dirty Jersey. As George, I don't say that. As George Collin would say. I love Jersey. Kiss it where it smells. Take it to New Jersey. I love Jersey. I want to be Jersey. I used to love the Jersey Shore. Well, some All right, so what do we have, baby? We have a little quarter okay. bell. Okay, we got. This is one of our favorites. Time for... Well, hold on. And we have some. Uh, we don't have some. We have a... <laughs> we have a ton We have a, about 100 strawberries, cut strawberries, because uh, this one over I here. I cut the whole thing. 
thing because I didn't want One wanna... cupcake for me and one cupcake for her. Yes. Those little sprinkles, very cute. Left over from from, from Rini. From Fourth of July, my mom made them. Oh, uh, your mother's like, the best. I brought she them really a whole is. Tray. Kisses to Rini. Two, two cupcakes. Left. Kisses to Rini, <laughs> and we might even share it with our mascot Jensen, the pain in the ass. But he can't okay. have cupcakes. That's okay. We'll make sure we. No. No. Okay. You can't have chocolate. Right. Don't have chocolate. It's not right. chocolate, is it? Yes, it is. It's red velvet. Oh, I know. Those idea. are red velvet cupcakes. Are they? With cream cheese frosting. Oh, well, I thought you could have the cream cheese uh, frosting. No, Lenny. Okay. All right, I guess not. Oh, all, right. all right. You know what time it is? <laughs> what time is it, baby? It's time for, for the, the wine of the week. The wine of the week. So, so grab your glass. Cheers. Salud. And, and have, have a seat. seat. It's, it's the, the wine of the week. week. The wine, wine of the of week, the baby. We're not supposed to cheers with nothing in it. We don't need bad luck. All right. Not Everything on I do. No. <laughs> All right, so we have a <laughs> Corbel. So we're actually having champagne tonight. Yeah, so a.k.a. champagne of the week. Champagne of the okay. week. That's what we should have said, champagne of the week. That's okay. So this is actually not my favorite. It's like my second favorite. It's like you're saying get closer to the mic, <laughs> but she's all right. She's all right. Oh, that's All a very right. powerful mic. Usually, so. I'm too close. That's why I was there you trying. Go. Thank you, Frankie. To. No buzzing this uh, today, right? I, think, I, think I thought I was too close. Is that better? Let me know if that's better. So, oh, babe, I got one of your hairs here. Okay. All right. All right so, the core bell. So, this one is actually really good because it's a pink champagne. It's a Bruta it's a rosé. So it's half It's a Bruta rosé. So, it's a little bit of both. It's pretty good. Okay, so there you go. Pretty good, I love All it. All right, so. All right. Let's open, pop this We're bad boy pop up. That bottle. Let's see what everybody's saying. Pop that bottle. I know, right? April, all these rules. <laughs> He's always critiquing me. Am I? No, I'm not always. He critiques everything. She's so, Why'd she's you do so, that? Why'd you do that? I, I love my girlfriend. I love my girlfriend. Way. It's better. Nah, nah, nah. Carla Russo, there he is. Carla Russo. Lou Greco from Uncle Louie Variety Show. It coming to Franny Fran, what's going on? What's up, Franny Fran? All right, is that better? Yeah. He said, bring the mic closer. All right, we're good. Tilt the mic toward. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. All right, how about like Easy that? there, Frankie Hudak. <laughs> Don't mess up our. Uh, I say, actually, we're gonna ask you if you want to be a guest. Of course. It should be. It should be. It's fine. Out. No, it's good. It's nice I know, and loud. It's really loud. It's nice and loud. How do you know? You're not on the other end. I know. Am Easy I there, loud killer. Enough, guys? Let me know if All I'm right, loud so enough, we're gonna put this. Too loud. I might be Gina Bim, no, nah, you're good. Just put it right there. You're fine. Your Everybody can is, hear you. Your mic is too hot. <laughs> Lenny, your mic is too hot. No, it's fine. All right, here we go. Hers Let's is the this. best. Of course. All right, here we go. We don't have champagne glasses. Though. That's all right. It's fine. Here is to our rock star listeners and viewers. We love you guys. And health, happiness. And, and love always. And love always. always. Love. 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 Love, love, love. Ooh, that was loud. That's the way we do it, baby. Let's get loud. <laughs> Let's funny. get loud. Bill said I should have a kill switch for Lenny's mic. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay, Joe. Don't worry. You and, you and, uh. He's the loud one, they said. You right, and, back. you said, and Sue. I'm going to jump. Are going to server. most definitely. Be bringing those T-bone steaks over. Okay. So. And going to be. DJ Chaz. Nina. DJ Chaz in the building. Okay, here we go. Hold on. I'm fixing that. Babe, can you put a. You guys are distracting me here. Another, I got it. Oh, you got to tilt it. I, that's when what I did. you tilt it, you don't get all I the. Know. Can you watch your hand so I don't spill all, all right, the pretty place? That's good. How come you're, he always spills his glass more? Hold on. Leave it. All right, there. that's it. That's it. Oh. <gasps> Listen, listen. That's the trick. You gotta put uh, your right. in there. Yeah. Put I the straw. Can I put another straw? Another straw bag. All right. Let's move. Let's get everything nice symmetrical right, here. here we go. Let's put this bad boy over here, so they can see okay, our so ready? beautiful face. So here we go. We're gonna have a little toast. Okay. Get a little champagne. Wait, no. We need something over here. Hold on. Put the champagne over there. Okay. All right. Go. Right there. And let's put, put this. Away. Hold on. Let's put Thank this you. over there. Yeah. <laughs> what do you want? Another one. <laughs> Oh, how many you give Hold me on, like Ralph Cramden and Honeymoon is ready. All right, come on. All right, Norton, you're not boofing Can right. Take a sip already? Come on. All right, salute everybody. Always salute. look, 
Always look high, Miyagi. Aye, always aye, look aye. high. <laughs> Daniel son, always look high. <laughs> she says. It's making me laugh. Uh, don't spit it out, please. <laughs> Swallow. Don't spit. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> Where did that come from? All right, I think we should go right into the first topic. All right, let's see what we got That's here. Shonaban. All right, we're going in. All the around the world. <laughs> you know what? Tonight's show, we Let think so. you really, truly are going to enjoy it. We really believe so because we have a lot of fun stuff. We have our new segment, Things That Make You Go. Hmm. Mm. So oh, we just started that last week, and that's actually one of my favorites. So much fun. All right, we're going into our first topic of Let's the night. Let's do it, baby. First. We're going to get right, right into it. First, first topic, topic of, of the, the night. night. Lucia. Let Let's do, do it, it right. right. <laughs> I said first topic of the night. Lucia and Leonardo. Let's, Let's do, do it right. right. Okay. Okay, baby. What's first the first topic? To- first topic, topic of the night. What are you tongue twisting? <laughs> I'm tongue tied tonight. See. First topic of the night uh-huh. is what? Is the naughtiest thing you have done in public and ne- and got away with it? You didn't get caught. Ooh, the naughtiest thing you, you, did, you have done in public Uh-oh. and you didn't get caught. I'm afraid to hear Joe and April's That's answers. <laughs> oh, my God. He's so bad. I'm not even <laughs> reading that, Joe. What? <laughs> That's, I'm not reading it. That's I'm it. Not, you have I'm to not. read Okay. That's I it. do? Okay. What's the naughtiest? Joe, Joe said my wife. <laughs> What's the naughtiest thing? <laughs> What's the naughtiest thing you have done? She's a in thing. You, uh, have to be, you have to describe your situation. What's the naughtiest thing you did in yeah, public? Yeah, you have to describe the situation. We want to hear details. Hold on. <laughs> What's the naughtiest thing you did? April, I know. I don't know where that came from. What's the naughtiest thing you did in public? <laughs> Uh, without getting caught. Yes. That slip. That was a four. That was a very Freudian slip. Let me tell you, April. What did you do now? Uh, All right. The S word that I said. Ooh, my honor. Yes, we have to know the details. Where were you? Were you outside? All right, babe. What's the noise thing you did in public without getting caught, right? Yes. Okay, go ahead, honey. What's yours? I have many. (laughs) <laughs> Why am I not surprised? I don't have Daddy just one. That. I don't have one. I've done a few. Naughty, the naughtiest? Yes, the naughtiest. Oh, God. I need a sip for this. <laughs> I don't know. You know what, babe? Yeah. Oh, no one's cool, I have to say. All right, I'll, 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 I'll tone it down a lot, okay? One thing was really cool. My ex-girlfriend and I, we lived together. We were together about three years. Okay. And... Here we go, guys. Hold on. And we used to, after dinner, to burn things off, we would go out and take a walk. Mm-hmm. And there was nobody on this path. Nobody whatsoever. Okay. Here we so, go. And I'll never forget it because... You were in the woods? We were in the woods. Okay. And we went through this path. And so... I guess it was hot, steamy one night. We were on the path. Yeah. And I threw her up against a tree. Okay. And it happened, and I marked my territory on the tree. Oh, all right. <laughs> so, so I guess, right. I guess Moving that's, right uh, I guess that's. Uh, <laughs> Too much information so she felt, there. So she felt both the trunk, both trunks. Oh my God. <laughs> Not Lordy. branches. I can't. I really can't. <laughs> that was a fun. I that was a fun one. All right. I uh, what else? Let me see. Okay. The <laughs> naughtiest thing. Dad, baby. You're they don't want to hear me. And you didn't get caught. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Come on. Kelly, you guys Marcy. Like to be juicy now. Come on. Yeah, I know. Oh my God. Uh, we right. we, oh my God, Lenny April. Yeah, yeah no. You know. So. <laughs> <laughs> So, Salud, said, guys. so, I don't know. This what? one's a, a little juicy, but it, it could also not be juicy. Oh, hold on, hold on. This is like Carla Russo. That was funny. But you know what? Wait till you hear hers. <laughs> <laughs> Fogarty's in girl. the Bronxville. I Sean Fogarty, my brother. No more ex girlfriend stories. <sighs> oh, no. That's okay. At least I never say She knows I love her. 
And it doesn't matter. If she says it, it doesn't matter. When you have trust... It's in the past. Yeah, it's in the past. It's before we knew each other. That's right. It's fine. All right, so what's yours? Come on, I want to hear some stories, guys. Not a good story to tell you, you new girl. Come on. Call a Russo. We love you, brother. Lou Greco. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Sean Fogarty? Shout out to Yakas PD, always in the house, and to our so, service men and women out there who keep us safe out of harm's way each and every day. We love you, and thank you for protecting us. Yes, While you're you. out there on a 4th of July, we're enjoying ourselves. Meanwhile, and we're being protected. We're being protected. Good. In that heat. Hi, baby. So, so what? So hot, what? <laughs> <laughs> Moo. All right, guys. I'm so sorry. I told him this yeah, story. Yeah, she had to tell me this one. You, you guys ready there. for this one? There we no. go. Let's just say, let's just say after, when you say goodnight and the expression Let's hit the hay. It's totally different for Lucia. Oh so go ahead, Lucia. Go ahead. Uh, oh, go ahead. No. That's okay. Your mom, your cousin. No, thank God, my cousin. Your godmother's play. watching. No. That's okay. It's my all good. Not watching, thank God, because I would. Nick Spano, what's up? And my cousin Eileen is away, so she's really? going to the show. Really? Come here, Spano. I love you. Right. Hope John's feeling better. I want to hear one of your stories, guys. Come on. No, you're I telling your so story. Mine. Yes, oh, this is a good mine one. Mine is really not that bad. I think that's hot. It's not that bad, Come on. though. Come on, get juice um. today. Hold up. <laughs> they want to hear some juice. Okay. Janie Delusia, mine, Mike Delusia. Mine is, what is it, I was babe? with a uh, boyfriend of mine. Good. And we were somewhere on vacation, I don't remember. And we spotted, we were walking around, like same thing as you, we were taking a little walk, and we spotted this barn, and we went inside, and it was empty, mm. and there was like big, you know, those big blocks of hay all over. So one thing led to another, and we got a little what a crazy bad girl in you the are. barn. What a bad girl you saying. are. Didn't get caught, because I... Hope, thank God, nobody was around. So was it fast? I, I guess it was a quickie. I guess it was a quickie. Not a quickie. Wasn't a quickie? No. Got hot up in her in the barn. <laughs> in the barn. Where their horses <laughs> and moo. There was no. Thank there God. There were no cows in. Uh, there was no. Which is the strangest thing. There were no animals in the barn. That's that's not so good. Weird. I would we think. The animals? I would think there'd be animals. Let's just say. Especially next you're an animal day. lover. Uh, there was no animals in there, though. I wouldn't have done, okay. it. I wouldn't have done it with animals there. Right. You know how much I love animals. That's yeah. disrespectful to the animals. Oh, it's disrespectful to the animals. I wouldn't have done that. Okay. And then the next day, I was pulling, you know, out of your ass. <laughs> That's a good one. It was That's like stuck to my clothes. Joanne Bachetta. <clears throat> oh, I've never done anything. I'm a good. Yeah, okay, <laughs> April Trombino. Come on. What's up, Joanne? Joey what Spiewak. What's up, Tiger? What's up, my brother? Dawn Bryan. Nothing Come on, everybody. Naughty? Nothing Come naughty. On, you guys. I know you got some naughty All right, stories, let's see. And I you mean, don't want to share with us. Let me see. Okay, guys, what's the naughtiest thing you did in public without getting caught? All right, let's say naughtiest or... Naughtiest or anything. It doesn't have to be naughty. Something you did in public and you didn't get caught. Let's, let's widen Okay, it doesn't have to be sexual. Yeah, it doesn't have to be okay. sexual. Let's okay. broaden it a little. The naughtiest could not be, it could be something right, babe, you did, to like, I don't know, like you sold a piece of gum or something. Hold on, but I'm thinking that we really are rock star listeners and viewers. Yeah. They're not felons, honey, okay? <laughs> They're not felons, all right? That's not a No felon. misdemeanors, no felons. Maybe you took a piece of gum by accident, I don't know. That's a naughty thing? Shame on you. Not, no, I didn't Shame do it. You. I said not naughty, I know. something else, you know, I'm trying to... I'm trying to liven it up. There you go, Carla Russo. Dangerous. <laughs> you want to get a little dangerous. I'm trying to liven there you it go. up. So Laura, how are you? All right. Yeah, Chaz, you're a good boy. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm right. sure of it. You and Joanne, I'm sure. Right. I'm sure there were very there were nights, I'm sure, coming back from an all hot and sticky. <laughs> oh, that that's hot. In a, uh, in a, what do you call it? In a barn? In a... Uh, in a food truck? That'd be pretty hot. Oh! Do I really have to say this? What? Oh. What'd you do now? 
You want to see another story? No, this, uh, this, this is pretty we hot. We want to hear from our boys. All right, guys, you ready for this one? Franny Fran says she's a naughty angel. I, I love picked, that. I picked up an ex-girlfriend. All right, wait, Joe's got one. All right, Joe, come on, Joe. Right, Sue and I made love at a new resort crazy. at the swimmer part in the hot tub. Read Lots of people around. Go ahead, do it. Sue and I made love at a new resort at the Swim Up Bar in the hot tub with lots of people around. All right. Wow. Okay. Salad Bongiorno. <laughs> Camarino, what's up? I know you guys had it. Everybody share. Everybody share it. Like and share Everybody's it. Everybody's being, um, what's that word? Everybody's Shy, being. Shy, bashful. Okay, I got a real one. All right. Lenny's got another one. This wasn't this administration, okay? It wasn't the Spanish administration. What? It was. It was. It was way back when. Probably I need a strawberry. Yeah, Go I think ahead. you need strawberry for this one. Go ahead. Okay, just don't choke, okay? I'm not going to... So I picked up my girlfriend. I was dating. It's probably like. I hope you were dating. Fifteen years ago. Yeah. And. Yeah. I picked her up in my garbage truck. And I, I dumped at the Westchester County facility, the Murph we call it, and I was naughty in the garbage truck on the way back. Okay. Drop, dropped her off, <laughs> went, went, went back, parked the truck, and went home. Okay. And then, and then that's it. That's it. All right. So. Oh boy. <laughs> All right. I forgot about that one. That that was I that was pretty cool. No, it's But like I said, it wasn't this administration. It was a long time ago. I think okay. it was the Amicone administration. Getting busy in the garbage okay. truck. That's it. That, that, that sounds like a rap song. Yeah, eight poor <laughs> garbage truck. Get busy in Joe, the what was his name? Oh, Kappa Bico. Sorry, Pete. Pete was the manager back then. Sorry, Pete. Oh no. <laughs> Clean up in aisle seven. Lenny, <laughs> you're really getting naughty. Anthony Rotella, what's up, Anthony? All right, so we only got. What's up, baby? We only got one. Uh, see, yeah, one I mean, come on, guys. Sorry, come on. What's Tommy this? Smooth checked in. What an Tommy awesome Smooth. show last night, Tommy Smooth. We're going to miss you guys. Now I have to wait till September so I can come on the show and sing. That's okay. You know what? We're going to bring him. We have a lot of guests coming up. Yes, we, we do. We have a lot We're of surprises. We're going down to Jersey to be on yes. Tommy's and Anthony's show. But I'm going to sing. Yeah. In September, that's coming up. You guys are going to love gonna that. You're going to sing September? No, I'm not going to sing din, 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 din. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to sing. I have to find a song. Okay. But we'd like to have maybe Tommy and Anthony here. Yeah. We'd love to have like all our, well, all our rock show here, listeners. Here's here. the thing, guys. We are actually looking for a studio. So shortly we're going to have a studio and it's going to be awesome. Yes. And we're going to have a live studio audience. That's going to be fun. And we're going to have a lot of people that we're interviewing. Um, some yes. really interesting people. A few celebrities. A uh, few regular. Uh, Leonardo DiCaprio is coming on? I'm not saying anything. <laughs> Oh my God! You, don't tell me, you, Leonardo. You got that connect, so I, I she know. met him at Wolf of Wall Street in Ardsley, New York. So I don't have that contact. I so. don't know. Yeah. Sherry, what's up? I Eric Schaefer, what's going on? Sherry, you could be in the studio indefinitely. Pamela Sue, oh, we want to hear what happened with the ex-boyfriend. The ex-boyfriend, remember? What? Pamela Sue. Oh, my, my my sister just said my, my niece, Chloe, has been sick. Oh, hope she feels better, Chris. How come I don't see that? Uh, no, what do you call it? Um, she just texted me. Oh, so. oh, I Love know. you, Chloe Ann. Oh, hope you feel better. better. Um, definitely, as soon as the show, I'll definitely yeah, call her. Um, definitely. And my beautiful Charlotte Rose. Um, Pamela Sue had the ex-boyfriend come over on Saturday. Oh, yeah, Pamela. Pamela. Oh, very good, I baby. Very I just remember. saw her. All right. Listeners I want to be in the studio audience. Definitely, Sherry. So, Pamela, what happened, we Pamela? No. So, for anybody that's just... G2, what's up, my brother? All right. For anybody that's just tuning in now, we are on the first topic, which <laughs> is, what is the naughtiest thing that you've done in public and didn't get caught? Oh, so Carlo Russo says, I've been married for 21 years. I don't remember anything before that. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh-oh. So great. You too, in red, looking hot. Thank you. Uh, Tommy, we love you. We Tommy. love you, brother. Love you and you. Anthony DiDio. John, what's Sorry. up, John? Liz, thank you so much for joining. Everybody share. Let's kick these numbers up. Let's get some people up in her. And we have a lot of fun stuff. So we're um, gonna we're gonna stay with this one for another five minutes. So okay. as Lucia said, if you're just tuning in, that's right. What is the naughtiest thing I pinned it up. you have done in public and didn't get caught? Yeah. And like I said before, if you don't want it doesn't have to be sexual. Yes. It could be anything. Yes. Anything that you did. Exactly. Anything that was naughty. Exactly. Naughty or what's another word? Dangerous. Dangerous. Yeah, dangerous. Um what's that word? Oh I feel like Tia. She's always like, What's that word? What's that Boy, word? Is that dangerous. Yeah. Um Risque, kind of like... Um, risque is like naughty, though. Okay. That's the same It's another thing. word for, for, uh, for naughty. Naughty or nice. That's a good one, Shari. Very good. What's the naughtiest or the April nicest? Said, <laughs> April said, Tommy, you can't answer this. Oh, yeah. We want to hear it. Come on. Come on, guys. Answer. You guys are being very shy. Very shy. Come on. Nice Strip nice. Live Raw Radio Interactive Talk Show starring Lenny and... Lucia. Go with the flow. Anything it goes. goes. We don't... Anything goes. That's show. it. We don't. We know. gotta tell our story, and I have yeah. to tell my, my the garbage barn, shop, the my garbage barn story. The barn. <laughs> I got another one, but I, I ain't Yes. That oh, one. tell that no, one. Come on, no. one more. Come on. No. Nope. That's okay. Tommy made love to cheesecake. Wait, about sixty times this week. Freak. Oh my god. I'm afraid of going away for life. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> Sherry. Not Sherry. All right, Sherry. All right. You know what? We're and gonna I'm give a, you a couple more minutes. And I'm gonna tell you guys, it's all because her, because she's like, uh, babe. I she has to blame everything. Babe, on me. I think our listeners want to get juicy. I said, all right, we'll try it. No, because I looked back on past shows. Yeah. I'm doing my research. What? And um, I wanted to see what you guys really want to hear as topics. So maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. So why don't you guys write? To our email. Stripped. S-T-R-I-P-P-E-D. <laughs> or. R-R-I-T-S at gmail.com. At gmail.com. Or just private message one of us and tell us what what are some some of the things you'd like to hear as topics. I'd be interested. That'd be like course. interesting for Yeah, I think that's too. great. Because then we could get some feedback from you, like what which show you like the best. Did you like when we got a little juicy or you didn't like Definitely. it? Definitely. You know, we could always improve. Good. Definitely. Right. Without a doubt. We like suggestions, comments. Absolutely. Everything. Good, so, babe. Very good. That would be And you could oh, actually. Joe said sex sells. If it's, if it's <laughs> that's easier. That's what I said. If it's easier, zazzradio at gmail.com. Simple. Zazzradio at gmail.com. Z A Z Z. R-A-D-I-O at gmail.com, okay? All right, baby, we're going to go on to... Uh-oh, Pamela Sue said, didn't go too good with the ex-boyfriend. We did not get a long... Wait, long a long sex, sex not A long sex, not... Oh, we did not get a long sex, not the same when you don't love someone. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. Sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, sometimes when you try to reconnect with... <laughs> Look what with Joe it, said. Look what Joe said. What did he say? Wait, topic, bring, bring, your favorite. bring your favorite sex toy, show and tell. <laughs> oh, God. Dawn says, I didn't get caught and I want to keep it that That's way. That's awesome. Right, cool. Fantastic. But I was getting back to Pamela Sue. I wanted to say that mm-hmm. sometimes when you try to reconnect with an ex, yeah, it's just not the same. I tried that like did two you, years really? ago. Really? I did because I was, you know. I was, I've done it too. I was sick of being out there, and he and he kept contacting me. Like, we, like we broke up. Like, oh my God, it must be like ten years ago. Mm-hmm. But he constantly stayed in touch with me. So I said, oh, you know, maybe I should give it a shot. But mm-hmm. you know what? You go back, and it's the same problem as it was before. Exactly. And it didn't change. So you, then you know you gotta like just like cut it. Yeah, I I'm the you same can't. way. I dated this girl actually a long time ago, and I seen her. On a on a on a site actually on a on, a, uh, on your famous dating on, site, yeah, and a dating site POF or match. And anyway, I Which try. I hope that you that you canceled all your memberships. Babe, I haven't been on it how long. <laughs> you have to cancel. If you don't trust me now, you'll never trust me. <laughs> I hope you canceled. The heck them out now. of here. 
Not that I don't trust you, but you Michelle Benson, what's up, Michelle Benson? I don't. If I'm not on them, whatever no, it is. No, you gotta delete them because otherwise. It's a pain in the ass. They'll keep sending you messages. So you just don't answer. Who cares? All right, all right. What's up, Michelle? So uh, let's see. You know what? No, it's funny. Sherry said she married. This is live. This is live. We don't. This banter of ours. Yeah, this is, is live. Is live. It's not rehearsed. We don't rehearse this, guys. So. This is just all the time. <laughs> Sherry says, I married, divorced, married, and then killed. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we have some really awesome news. We're, we're really thinking about this. Um, we are? Yeah. In October, for Lucia's birthday. Oh, you're bringing that up. This is really cool, guys. Say. Um, we might be taking a road trip and right. making one of her dreams come true. Yes. And what <laughs> dream is that? To see Graceland, Elvis's house. I'm so excited, yeah. and that's what I want to do for my birthday. I told Lenny that's what I want to do. And I and I love, of course, making you happy. That's numero yes. uno. Of well, course. it is my birthday, so it should be my choice, right? But this is really like one of your dreams. Yes, and to it me, is. and to me, and I always told you this that I was always a man that loved to do something no other man has done for you, and to be very special. So this, to me. As much as 15 hours or 16 hours driving. It's only 15. I'm and, us, and, and you And you stopping at probably every other rest stop every to, pee, 10 minutes. to pee. Because she's got a, a, girl, a little girl's bladder. I love her to death. But Lenny girl. makes fun of me because <laughs> I, but, I shouldn't say that. But she I loves to, Elvis. I have to, she I loves have Mal a problem. I have a very small bladder. And I have to pee a lot. That's okay. So every time I drink water, I see it. Like, I see it forget. It'd be it. different if you had six kids. You know what? But no, but I think I'll, I've always had it ever since I was right. a kid. Like, I've always had it. But I think a lot of women are like that. We just okay. have to, like, pee yeah. a lot. <laughs> All right, so anyway, bring a gun there. Place is right, bad. Oh, you know what, Chaz? It's so funny because... Well, you know what I was telling... That's what I was that's telling That's it, Chaz, I yep. I said a friend of mine went, and I said we have to stay in Graceland. We have to uh, stay at the Heartbreak Hotel, which I think they changed the name. And we're just going to literally stay right there. We're yeah. going to do, like, the tour, the, the house, the garage with all the cars, the studio... The plane, mm -hmm. like just everything, and it'll probably take us like two days. And I told Lenny we can't go Outside. off the property. Yeah. Well, I have a and nine millimeters <laughs> anyway, so, so I could bring we'll I could bring drive. the nine. But guess what? We could drive to Texas. I know that six hours. I know how to handle yeah, myself. Uh, we can drive to Texas. But you know what? I always say, don't mess around in unfamiliar territory, no yeah, matter where I'm you not are. Going out of there. So anyway, yeah. I mean, li listen. Oh my God! See, Tommy's wife has the same problem. DJ Ross, the boss, is in the house. We'll see you Saturday, wife. my brother. My wife has the bladder of an infant. That's uh, me. Horrendous. That's me. Antonio. What's, what's up, Antonio? Antonio? See, I feel better now. That's Thanks, right. Tommy. My Brooklyn brand block party this Saturday. Everybody, show up. Have a good time. Vinny Pastor's birthday celebration. It's old school Brooklyn. Chaz, I hope to see you there. Uh, DJ Ross the Boss will be in the house. DJ and Zazray.com will be in the house. MCG2. Uh, everybody, all our Brooklyn okay, cool. peoples. So, all right, baby, let's go. All right. It is time for, for the shoe, shoe of, the of the week. week. The shoe, shoe of, the of the week. week. Stop, stop, stop. Ladies, you're beautiful from your hair. Down to your pretty Be little toes. toes to, to your, your feet. feet. It's, it's the, the shoe, shoe of the, of the week. week. The shoe of the week, baby. Are you ready? I am ready. Okay. So hold on. What prior yes. to us going on? What's this ensemble, and where is it <laughs> Why from? Why you gotta know? Oh, now. Why you gotta know? I have to say this. I have to say don't this. Don't say my secrets. Yeah, wait. No, I have no. to say. It. I have to you say. You know, Lenny. Some things you just don't say. No, I really want to say no, it. No, you're not saying it. I really want to say it. No. Guess what? I'm not saying He's it. Not saying <laughs> yeah. It. He's yeah. In big yeah. All right. I'm always in trouble, everybody. I'm always in trouble. <laughs> All right, so, hold on. so where is it from? The shoes are these shoes. Get over are... it. Get over. Okay. This is when everybody shares. Robin, oh God, what's I up? I can lift my leg up. Hold on. I gotta hold this. These oh, shoes. Oh, I didn't even see them. Uh, these shoes are from Fredericks of Hollywood. Oh, They're really Fredericks old. of Hollywood. Hold my on. Foot is falling can down. I check? Hold Let on. me check the funk. Would you? Stop? No funk whatsoever. Thank God. All right. So, so show them. Wait, wait, wait. What's the? It's a clear. Well, you have panties on your. No, but. Lenny, come on. Put my 
my foot like this. She does. You have pretty feet, I will tell you. And I'm not. I don't have no foot <laughs> fetishes whatsoever. But let's you move this glass here, hold on. and let's put this over here. Okay. And oh. wait, make sure you can't. Uh, you're good. All there right. you go. Are you sure? Very pretty, babe. Let me hold it. Very pretty, and she's got a nice spray tan. <laughs> <laughs> spray tan. So where are they from? You didn't even say I it. I said Fredericks of Hollywood. That's it. Just Fredericks of Hollywood. Yes, Fredericks of Hollywood. Very sexy. Too. And what? And what are they? Four inches, two inches, These three are inches. Five and a half. Five and a half. Yeah. Okay. Very cool. Everybody share, share, Frank Vermonti. Okay. Joe Pastore. <laughs> the best Zeppelins will be there. Oh, cool. Chaz is, uh, oh, that's awesome. So, Chaz, your, uh, your food truck is going to be there. Oh, awesome. Or your sisters. That's great. I'm so glad that, you, that your, uh, your food trucks are going to be at the Brooklyn Block Party. No sausage that's and cool. peppers. That's cool. Oh, definitely. We're going to eat sausage and peppers. Oh, no, we're having sausage and peppers. Oh, we're having everything. Okay. All right, so to our second topic. Our second topic. Now, this is this is a good one. I like this one, too, but you actually picked this one, right? Yeah. Yes. Well, we both did. We both oh, did. We both did. Okay. All right, hold on. So the second topic this is... This is a fun one. This is a fun one. All right, so what would you do... What would you do... If you were the... Opposite sex. For a day. Oh my lord, help me. What would me. you do? What would you do? If you could be the opposite sex if you for were a day. What would you do? The opposite sex for sex. A day. Thank you, Dawn. For the day. Now I I Um This is very let's see if I missed any comments here because while well, I have my foot up there, I don't know. What would you do if you were the, <laughs> the sex for the day? Okay guys, so this one's a really Hold on. This is a fun one. Okay. Let's see. All right, so I miss anybody. I'm going to tell you straight out. I would be a escort. And okay. I would have men. Aww. I would have men. I would travel the world. Yeah. I would try. I'd be in France one day, Italy. <sighs> I'd be all over the place. I'd be a man. I'd be a female. <laughs> I don't know, you know. I, I would, would just be happy that I didn't have to pee every five minutes. <laughs> that's great. That's oh, please. How, oh, how do you man. think it? How do you think it would? Be, but here's the best part. How I was, wouldn't have to. But I how, have this bladder of like no, but the be, infant bladder. Yeah, but it'd be cool because you'd be able to whip it out. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't have to pee in a flower so pot, or you know what I mean. That's true. That's true. That's so funny. <laughs> or. Uh, Joe said he'd do me. He'd do himself. He'd do himself. <laughs> What's up, Donna DeGordy? How are you? Sal, how are you? So we're getting a little juicy. What would you do if you were the opposite sex for the day? Yes. Franny Fran. Do. I do me. You're so funny, Joe. <laughs> funny. I don't know. That's a tough one. Come on, babe. What, what would, would you I do? do? What would I do? Hmm. I'm thinking. So I would have boobs, and I would have I would have breasts. Yeah. Okay, Lenny. Don't get. And I would have crazy. that thing down there. Yes. We all I could say Lenny. is, thank God that I'm a man. Thank God. All right, I agree all with men. Sherry. Sherry said I would love to see how a man thinks when they say I'll call you right back. <laughs> <laughs> when, oh, thank you, Donna. When a man says they call you right back. Rosanna. Right back to them is like three or five days later. <laughs> That's what they mean, right back. So. Well, we listen, we never played games. We were always raw and real. No, and not you. I'm fun. just saying. No, but I'm just saying with us, you know. Like Donna said, love the red on you guys. Thank, Thank you, you, Donna. Donna. Thank you, Donna. That's my ex-landlord. Oh, cool. That is cool. Abra said, I enjoy not having to do makeup and hair. Yeah, that's true. I enjoy having to do so makeup and hair. Oh, okay, very good, okay. Joe said the first few hours I'd play with my boobs. <laughs> <laughs> and I'd take my brow off as soon as I got home and rub my boobs. Oh, God. Isn't that the biggest Randy. thing with you ladies? No, I don't do that. No? As no, soon as you, I don't. As soon as you, you have to take your brow off and you have to rub them, no? No. You press them? Where do you get this, Lenny? Oh, always. Any of my girlfriends, I always. I don't do that. Well, probably because they were fake, that's why. Jack Riley, what's up? Rosanna. All right, what's so up, Eva? Um, 
We're doing good on time. We got plenty of time, I, which is awesome. You know what? I agree with I agree with our viewers. I agree with Cherry in uh, April. Mm. I would love to be a man so I wouldn't have to do hair and makeup. That's okay. number one. Number two, I would love to be a man for a day so I could see really what goes on in their heads. Because then good. when I turn back into the woman, <laughs> I'd be up on on everything because I'd really know it. Yeah, but that's thinking. only one day. Yeah, but you get you learn a lot in a day. Yeah, just one day. No, you really would. Twenty four hours, you think you? No, I just I would just like know I know enough. Know what? Just watch what women want. <laughs> what, what women no, want from really, Mel Gibson really and what men inside, want with that, that, that new movie that we just watched. Oh, it's funny. yeah, that was funny. Everybody like and share. Becky, what's up? Denise. So what would you do if you were the opposite sex for the Joe day? Joe said he'd buy all Gucci issues. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. And there's a lot. You know what I would do? You know what I would do? What? I would be. I would do typical. I would dress up like to the T. Yeah. Look hot. Right. And I walk right in front of construction site. <laughs> <laughs> and I want all whistles. Oh my god. I would god, love this. Really? I would love to be a woman to get all those calls. Those it's cat calls. Annoying, though. Those cat calls. It's just annoying. one. Just it's once. Annoying. Just one day. They're not very attractive though. No, but. Because it's like, what do they think? They whistle at us, they, they make these stupid sounds, and we're going to turn around and say, oh my God, you're the man of my dreams, I'm running right to you. <laughs> well, you never know, you know? No. You never know. No, that's right? not going to do it. That's not how you talk to I mean, you met a garbage man. man, I mean, you know? You're this not, construction worker, you're not you know? a garbage man now. Well, for 16, <laughs> for 16 years, and then prior well, to you that. You were a DJ when I met you, though. So oh, <laughs> wow, so there you go. There you go. She takes okay. the DJ of the garbage, man. Okay. No, half no. and half. That was good, right. babe. Um, Lenny would give you the shoes. <laughs> oh, you know what? I think Joe Historic probably, he would probably rock a pair of stilettos better yeah, than me. we don't like catcalls. It's so annoying. No, definitely not. Lenny would be a prostitute. A sl <laughs> yes, I was. said I'd be an escort. Yes, he would. I'd be in he France would. one day. I'd be in Italy. I see the whole world. Yes, Sherry, definitely. And it would be a private plane. You only see Sherry agrees from a man. You only need one day. That's right. I only need one day. You want to? You want to laugh? This is the. Let me be dressed up like a woman. All right, well, I, that that you know what's funny is I don't really take a long time to get ready, you know. So I, even though I'm an uber sexual, the whole thing wait, where whoa, you whoa, see. Whoa, whoa, hold whoa, on, hold on, wait, wait, wait. The Friday, he wait, said wait. He doesn't. I does take a long. long time. No, I don't take a long time. Okay. What? Um, hey, babe, what time are you going to be over there? Oh, come now. I'm ready. I'm ready. I get here. Didn't even take a shower yet. Well, Still, like. Well, I was doing stuff. All right. I, I didn't take a shower. You. I got to take a shower. I got to do this. I got to do that. By the time we get out of here, it's like 45 minutes later. Oh, Joe Bernard. Thank you, Joe. I'd be the exception and actually be ready to go out on time. Women are always no, late. Uh, Lenny, always not, late. No, Lenny, but you're never on time. Late. You're but never, I'm late. always on time. You are always on time. I am. You're always late, Lenny. Not I'm always late. That. I'm here on time, and we don't leave 45 minutes later. Karen Morrow. Over. Brandon say, Renzi. What's up, Brandon? Say, come over now. We're going now. I'm starving. Eric Renzi. Here, and it's 45 minutes later. Sarah Renzi. What's up? Right, just saying. Family. Tommy Padillo. What's up, Tommy? <laughs> Share it, everybody. We love you guys. Thank you so much for checking in. I know he's lying, Cherry. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'm telling you the truth. I get here and we leave 45 minutes later. Are you kidding me? No, I'm serious. That's the only time to say, babe, do me a favor. You know the thing that you brought in the Relco? Shave my back, please. No, no, no. That's no. 10 I'm minutes, 15 about minutes. When you, you should be ready when I get She here. says to me, and I couldn't believe she said, she said, babe. What did I say? You want me to shave your legs? I said, hell no. <laughs> Why would I want to shave my legs? Why are you out of your bird? You're so funny. <laughs> I oh said, you out of your bird. <laughs> All right, let's see. Franny said I would transform into a Yorkie, Yorkie pup. We'd love, love to know. So why they tilt their heads? Oh, I know. Fred. So you ready for this? You ready for it's this? So cute. I would this love to know of, what it's all. This is one of the funniest things you're ever gonna hear. What? Okay. What now? I've had so many girlfriends that I've been faithful to, of course, right? <laughs> that says to me, what? crazy enough, really funny, not only one, but many. She yeah. needs more champagne. I need more for this. <laughs> right I'm going to drink the whole bottle. <laughs> 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 
the funny story. Give me a straw. Give me a straw. Okay, hold on. You ready for this, guys? This is fun. This is really funny, actually. I don't know if anybody, guys on here, I don't know if women have ever told you this, but it is probably the funniest thing I ever experienced for a woman to actually say to me. (laughs) So, so you ready? Yeah. Okay, drum roll. Drum roll. I wish that thing downstairs, I was able to screw it off and take it with me on vacation. Oh, my God. I swear to God, many of my girlfriends have said that to me. Oh, yours? Yes. Oh, all right. They said to me, I wish the thing could screw off and I could take it on vacation. I don't know about your girlfriend, ex-girlfriends. I really don't. Isn't that funny? Yeah, I think I need the whole bottle. (laughs) (laughs) I think I do. Oh, so funny. So everybody, I don't know if, listen, Joe. That's kind of an insult when you think about it. No. Because they're saying like they don't want you to do that. That's mean, don't you think? No, it's attached to me, so they want to. They said they it's want so to take damn... it and leave you home. <laughs> no, the thing I'm thinking of. No, it's me going away. It's me That's them good. going away, not being with me. So they want to. It's so oh, damn. It's so damn good that they want to screw it off and take God. it with them. Okay, well, That's the way I look at it. Can we have their numbers, <laughs> Joe? Said. I know these stories. I can't. I'm telling you, it's true. I can't lie about that. Melanie, what's up, Melanie? Oh my God! Wait, wait till we. Why did I even ask? Wait till we get on Sirius Radio. Wait till. I'm gonna eat the cupcake. Wait till we. Wait until we. We're gonna get banned from. Wait until we're gonna be we're gonna be the 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 female male and female version of Howard Stern. FCC is gonna be (laughs) all over us. I don't know. My baby. Yeah. All Here's right. to us. Here you go. Here's the fun. Here's to and you. And those beautiful and your, green you know eyes. What? Those beautiful green Stop. eyes. Okay, here we go. We need the mic kill switch. I know, Joe. So, what would you do if you were the opposite sex, guys? We have another five minutes, eight o'clock. <laughs> okay. So, we have a few more minutes on this. Topic. Sherry said that's the way Letty took Which it. That's not the way like, I took it. Uh, very funny, I think. <laughs> funny topic. Come on, guys. Sex. What do you think? What would you do if you could be the opposite trying sex to think. for a day? I'm trying to think. What would you I said do? enough, Lenny. I'm trying to think. You said be enough. an escort. Oh, what more could you say? Oh, I know what I would do. What? Oh, I got even a better one. God help me. Know what I would be? Oh, my God. I would be a stripper. <laughs> I would be a stripper. <laughs> I would be a like a real, like in one of those really nice clubs, like a, like a, I don't know, like. And you'd have fake boobs. Very pop. It's okay. A All nice the fake work. boob. Yeah, but you know what? I would. I would want to. I would want. I want. I would want to see how much money I can make in a day. <laughs> I want. I would want to see how much I could convince guys. To throw money at me. Uh, April, Lenny needs a cupcake. I'm going to shove the cupcake. <laughs> <back this minute. laughs> Allie, what's up, Allie? <laughs> Christina, what's up? Christina, what's up, Chris? All right. How come you get pe- I might come I go later. kick my ex's ass. Cynthia. Tommy Smooth want, wants to be J-Lo for the day. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Oh. That's a great one. Cupcake. Dawn Bride said, God bless you, Lucia. <laughs> Uh, we have fun. We really do have fun. That's okay. what it's all about. I am buying those cupcakes, though, but I know I can't eat them because it's oh. going to be messy. No, we can't do that. That's after the show. After the we show. We got an hour. I got a week for the Everybody, cupcakes. like and share. Like and share it. Okay, okay. so we're going to go back. Uh, we're going to speed ahead, not go back. We're going to go <laughs> to... We're moving right along. Right along. l and L. Terminology. L&L terminology. So this is fun. Everybody knows if you're Italian out there, and if you're not, there is one word that you always mention, and it is <laughs> on a Sunday, of course, the yes. Italian dinner. Yes. And it's the, you know, the, the pasta, the pasta. sauce, the meatballs. Hold on. The big oh. question is. What? 
You know what? We're going to leave this for getting to know our rock star listeners and viewers. Okay. You're I'm very that? Yeah. You're that? Yeah, we're okay. going to change. Right. Okay, so it's going to go into this. All right, so the LNL terminology is. And for anybody that's a new listener, let's yep. just tell them real quick. Ray Soroka, what's up, Frank? The LNL terminology. Elliot Florence in the house. What's up? What's up, Elliot? Is um, a word that we say because we like to make up words, or maybe it could be a word that you guys have said. Or like vacation name. Vacation. We make up our own terminology, so it's LNL. L and L terminology. That's correct. And the word of the week is Roni. Roni. And when Lenny said it, you know what I said? I thought of Bobby Brown song Roni. <laughs> to Roni. Funny. Cause I don't call I don't call macaroni Roni. Let me tell you something. I say macaroni or your, pasta. your your parents have always said Do you want them ro- have some Ronis? You wanna now? come yeah, you wanna come over and have some Ronis. Or do you want Ronies? It's always no. it's Italian thing. Yeah, it's an Italian thing. But but, but it you know I'm I'm curious. Do you guys has anybody ever said that to you? I I think it's more of like a grandmother thing. Yeah. You know, and, use and a it mother in a thing. Sentence. Use it in a sentence. Oh, Leonardo, come over for some Ronies on Sunday. Oh, in fact, in funny. fact, no one mentioned it. Christina's mom, Marina. She said, said, she said, Lenny, Tia, Tia, come over for Ronies one day. Ronies. Okay. So, Ronies. So, it could be plural, Roni. My dad says spaghetti. 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 <laughs> you want some spaghetti? Frankie V. What's up, Frankie V? Joe said he wants to be April for a day so he can wear his Az Radio t shirt. Oh, my God. So funny. We don't have. Uh, t-shirts for men, that's why. Well, we're going yeah. to very shortly, and we're working on our strip live raw radio interactive talk show starring Lenny Lucia. Go with the flow, anything goes. <laughs> uh, Mondays, 7 to 9 on Facebook Live, and we're working also on getting on Zazradio.com. Yeah. We're working out the kinks. Uh, we just had uh, some diagnostic um, changes today where we're much cleaner and clear. <laughs> the sound on our flashback work mix, dance class and freestyles. Uh, dance classics and freestyle, um, which is pretty awesome. Nine to five, and uh, we you know we have a lot of awesome stuff. Like I said, coming soon. Frankie Hudak's Rock and Comedy Hour, and a lot of good stuff. Again, if you're a new artist like Magic, Magicus, and Joey Action and Amy Forjoni, if you want to have an awesome platform to play your music, we would love to do it for you. You know, we'll check out your music. If it's good, guess what? We're going to play it for you. Like Marie Elena Venuto, Vinnie Maduno, um, Angelo Venuto, all of his awesome music. You know, Lisa Messina. Um, so it's pretty cool to have another platform. Tommy G, what's up, Tom? How are you? Okay, so we're still on the uh, terminology, well, Roni. So using it in a sentence. Uh, I had some Ronies tonight. There you go. <laughs> I did. And, and I'm going to have brought, Ronies afterwards. I Lenny the la- leftover Ronies. Oh, how <laughs> awesome is that? She always take you always take care of me. Yes, Thank I you, do. Always, You're welcome. You always take care of me. I appreciate it, baby. Yes, Lenny's going to have some Ronies you know what's after up. the show. You know what's up. A man's heart is through his... Stomach. There you go. Not all of them. No. This one. <laughs> you know I can yeah. eat... Yes, I know. How about I that? Know. How about that stuffed shells you had from Midland Avenue Pizzeria? Our friend Stephen Grace Macri, uh, delicious food with the uh, with Would the uh, with the uh, pork chop vinegar peppers, and we had Zeppelins afterwards. Yes, we did. And thank you so much, Ophelia. Oh my God. Oh, that food was really good. That wine was good. And the wine, we had the wine last night. That was good. That was really that good. nice Cabernet. Yes, that so, was. I like that one. Then it'll be 400 now, pounds. <laughs> Jay know. Gomez, there you go, Jay. What's up? Magicus <laughs> is in the house. And D Spano's in the house. What's going on? Gina DiNapoli's in the house. What's going on, guys? Andre, what's up? Make sure you guys share, like, and share. Once again, you're listening to Strip Live Raw Radio Interactive Talk Show starring Lenny and, and Gia. Go with the flow. Anything, Anything goes, goes, everybody. And we are presented by... ZazRadio.com, the ultimate internet smash up dance radio station yes. and rock star listener experience in the world. Yes. So, we have one of our new school freestyle artists who are 
who is actually awesome. J.R. Gomez is in the house. Okay. Magicus. Cool. Cool. And once again, we play Magicus music on the Flashback Work Mix from 9 to 5, Monday through Friday on Zazaria.com, the Flashback Work Mix. So it's pretty cool. Shout out to Richie DePrima, his manager. So if you want to book him, speak to Richie DePrima. Oh, All right, everybody. So getting to on. know no. our rock star listeners and viewers. And now you change this one? Yeah, babe. Do you want to use the one because you said you want to use? We're gonna one. we're gonna go with two because we have plenty of time. Okay. So go ahead. So this is the part of the show that we like to know more about our rock star listeners and viewers. We yeah. like to get inside your life a little bit and in your know heads. in your head your yeah. life what you like to do things yeah. that you do. So tonight's question is: What tell us what what exciting thing did you do this week? Or last week, or this month. Yeah, we want to know. We want to know what what exciting thing happened to you. What or it could be in the past couple of that's months. That's right. But, what exciting thing did yeah. you do this week? Or you have something exciting coming up. I mean, it's month. Fourth of July. Did you have a party? Did, did you do the house shuffle like I do? You know, you go to this house, this house. You know, uh, uh, Thanksgiving, Fourth uh, of July. You have the barbecues. What exciting thing did you do? Yes. And also. I have to mention this. What? I'm really, this is big. You ready? What? This is almost as big as the Oreo dunked in the milk. How long does it take for you? Don't talk about Oreos The again. Oreo then in I the have milk. To go to shop right on the way okay. home. Okay. <laughs> so, so our big, big, big thing was. All right, I need another strawberry. How long? Put my strawberries back did, here. Okay. How long? No, here. It takes some how away long, from me. You got, I wanted one. You got it three over one. there. Oh, you're a pain in the ass. Let me tell you. <laughs> Princess, what's up, Princess Robin? How are you? So, what exciting thing did you do this week? But, what? This is what I'm going to ask this, and then we're going to get the answer. What? This is a very controversial. Very controversial. Yeah, you just thought so of it. So, get ready, yes. Well, you let know them me. answer that one first. Okay. okay. What exciting things did you do this week? This week so, or this month or you have something coming up. So this, and how long is, when you eat an Oreo, <laughs> how long do you dunk the Oreo <laughs> until you pick it up back we from? We asked that already. Uh, no, we got to know this now. We got to know an exact Yeah, time. we got to know. <laughs> when you dunk your Oreo, how long do you dunk the Oreo in? <laughs> all right? And then you eat it. That's what I want to know. Because if you dunk it in for more than 20 seconds, the thing's falling apart. Right. Or if you don't, you know what happens to me sometimes? It has to be I a don't perfect. Dunk it, in enough. it has to be at least like 10 and seconds. And then I have to go back another. <laughs> because I'm going to tell you what happens. You dunk it, yeah. you lose it. Right. It goes in the bottom. And then you got to get the spoon. And then you got to get the spoon. <laughs> the spoon. So, All but right. this one's even more controversial. Okay. All right. Gina, what's All up, right. Gina and Nick Sirocco? Love you guys. What's going on, So guys? glad that you guys checked in. Okay, so what exciting things do you guys have coming up or that you did this week? I'd say, what, what exciting things did you Four do? Four seconds, April said, for the Oreo. Four seconds, you think? I want to go with... You know what? I'm I want to go with five seconds. I'm going to tell you guys next week we're going to have Oreos. <laughs> And we're gonna oh, have. Oh no! We're gonna, yes. That's not gonna be good because I'll eat the whole and thing. And we're gonna have. We're gonna have the, the time. We're gonna do the Oreo test. <laughs> the Oreo test. We're gonna do the strip live raw radio interactive talk show starring Lenny Lucia. That's not gonna be good. You know why? Because we're, we're gonna doing get. It. You know, after you eat an Oreo. That's yeah, okay. Don't smile after you it eat an Oreo. It doesn't matter. You know why? I don't smile much anyway. No, you know. I until, until, I, until I get my beautiful <laughs> pearly whites no, but from it's my doctor. Fall in my teeth. From my doctor, John Castanaro, coming soon. Lenny's, Leonardo's brand That's new pearly white. That's not going to be good. I'm going to have what? Oreos all in my teeth. That's okay. I'm going to have to leave. We're going to do the Oreo test next week. We're going to blast this out. This is going to be a big thing. Huge thing. I'm excited. But I'm, I'm gonna... getting a pack of Oreos in practice. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> that was great, babe. I'm That's great. Life. That was great. All right. That's it. All right, so. April says four seconds. All right. Okay, so. How, four else? seconds? What, what? So that's a one, two, three, three four. four. Is that one, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand? Three, four, five, six. All right, this is a this is big. 
This is going to be a big thing for Strip. Because you know when we get it right. No, this is going to be then, huge. Then we can, then I can have my Oreos. No, this uh, is a Oreos. big thing I'll for Strip. I'll eat the whole bag. No, no, no. This is going to be, this, right. we're going to have a nice thing of Oreos. We're, uh, listen, we have to have <laughs> lactate milk for me and regular milk for her. Oh my God. Okay? Tommy's. Tommy Spoon said the show made me yeah, an sugar freak. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? I'm, I'm so everybody go. get ready for next week because we are not drinking. We're not going to have a wine of the week. We're going to have the milk of the week. Milk of the week. Milk does milk the body and good. Oreos, yay. Lactate Can't wait. and regular milk and the Oreo. We want to know. That's it. We're drinking milk on the show. Yeah, but yeah, because the milk does the body <laughs> good. Let me tell you something. <laughs> <I knew. laughs> very good. <laughs> you must you must have a lot of Oreos and milk, I'll tell you this. All right, so anyway, so here's the big controversial. Are, are you ready? Yes. What? How many seconds? Is it sauce or gravy? Uh, I don't, I want to know. Uh, Lenny and Lucia want to know, is it sauce or gravy? You don't have to be Italian. Is it sauce or or gravy. Okay. It's very simple. Okay. I'm going to tell you. What do you say? It's sauce. Okay. It's sauce. I'm going to tell you. Wait, 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 wait. It's sauce, but when there's brajo, when there's sausage, when there's meatballs, <laughs> it's gravy. I want to say get, my family. Get it through your friggin' thick skulls, my family, rock star listeners and viewers. It's gravy. It's gravy all around? I said gravy. Because, yeah, growing up in the Bronx with my grandmother, it was always like, oh, I got to make the gravy, you know? And even today, we still say that. We never say sauce. We Slick say Rick gravy. from Sarasota, Florida. It's with my sister. 100% correct, Lenny. Thank you, Joe. Joe, Finally. Thank on. you, Joe. Thank you. My Naja Mazeta. Thank you. Know you know what it is? Yeah, it is definitely sauce, but when you grow up, Rebecca, yeah. thank you, Becky. It's sauce. Thank right, you. Honey, can I talk Karen to you Gravy. Me? I'm sorry, DJ Peter again. Honey, drunk. I don't know. No, I'm be. not drunk. Come on here. All right, for all the old school. Hold on. Now I am not drunk. No, wait. I can't yeah, that. Get for close. all the old school Italians this is so out damn there, good. Right. It is good. growing up in the Bronx, old school Italian, the grandmothers always said gravy, but we know it's sauce. Oh, they ever knew. But you had to respect the grandmother because she said gravy. Yep. You know. So deep. So, what do you think it is? I know that the correct is obviously sauce, but because gravy is brown or whatever, oh. and our viewers are right. You just put that on mashed potatoes, like Franny Fran said. Mm -hmm. But when you grow up with with old school, like like my grandmother, mm -hmm. you know, right up, born in Italy and everything, mm -hmm. they always said gravy. I don't know why, because I never understood it either. But I grew up that way, so I grew up saying that. This is going to cost you an engagement ring very shortly, <laughs> maybe within the six months. Is it sauce or gravy? Give me a freaking answer. I said, answer. I said, I say, go ahead. Oh, did I say that, guys, on live? Oh, shit, no, I actually I said that. Know. Oh, shit, Ken, what? Gravy. It's sauce or gravy? I say if my grandmother is looking down <laughs> at my grandparents, I better say gravy. Otherwise, they're going to haunt me tonight. But sauce... But it's, it's gravy. Well, are you when, asking what is the correct way, or are you asking what listen, you were raised on? But sauce is marinara, right? Marinara is sauce. Sauce. Yeah. sauce. Gravy is the meat, no? Uh, yeah, Bajol, we always made it with the meat, but we, always, we never really sausage. made marinara sauce. All right, so there you go. Muscles marinara. So. <laughs> I was like, well, Lenny, muscles marinara. Hey, how All you right. doing? No. Um, if you're asking what is the correct, <laughs> Yes. Way? Yes. Or what is what your your parents or your grandparents said? You didn't cl clarify. Sto you need to clarify. Paprendo la salsa. All right. Must be different parts of Sicily. You have before. to clarify. Babe. All right. Babe, is it sauce or gravy? It's very simple. A uh, Sunday a Sunday dinner with meatballs. All right. I'm going meatballs, brajol. Sausage. I plead the fifth. Okay. <laughs> then she's getting a ring eventually. <laughs> <I'm never gonna laughs> <tell you. laughs> Vita salsa. Oh, it's salsa? Oh, my God. 
pizza I sauce is the best in Yonkers. DJ Peter, you're right. I will say one more thing. Though. Shout out, hold on. Shout out to Pizza Bar, my boy Angelo Slice. Still haven't had. Go check out. Oh, you haven't the, the no, home of the two foot no. super slice. Oh, I gotta bring and you that. Let me baby. tell you something, Lenny. I bring you that. Just so you my know, my boy Angela. I am a pizza connoisseur. Let me tell you. Growing up in the Bronx, really. You, my pizza has to pass the droop test. The droop test. If it doesn't pass the droop test, All right, so what's the I'm droop not test? eating it. What's the droop the test? The droop test is if you fold your slice uh -huh. and you hold it up and you get ready to eat it. And all of a sudden it droops down and the cheese starts going all over the place. That's not a good slice. But if you fold okay. your pizza and you hold it up okay. and it's perfectly straight, okay. that's a great slice. I'm going to tell you my sex. My, my, what does that have to do on. with pizza, lady? I'm going to tell, tell you. Oh, God. I'm going to tell you the sex test. You ready? Okay. If What's we that go, have to do with all pizza? that, if we go to my friend's place, right, and we get a two foot super slice, and you ask for a knife and a fork, I don't do that. I don't okay. eat pizza. Like okay, that. all right, good, because she's getting asked that night. Then, no, I'm Lenny. <laughs> I don't need to. I can't stand when a woman asks for a friggin' knife and fork to eat a pizza. Uh, Lenny, you're to piece eat of pizza. pizza with your hand. Yeah, I grew thank up in the Bronx, so why thank would I eat oh, it when a knife and That's why I love you, baby. Thank you, baby. That's why I love you. She gonna diss me. She gonna diss me on Facebook live up here. Because you're like kiss me, bitch. You're like <laughs> there you go. Right, you know that's a curse. Shh. No cursing, Lenny. Nana always said sauce. Thank you from Catania. Thank April. I love you, April. <laughs> it's so you know what? Something about April. April, you know what? I think we're gonna get a GoFundMe, and we're gonna bring you from Ohio. Yeah. Iowa, Ohio, right? Yeah. And we're going to bring you yes. here to be with us. Yes. I'm and we're going to bring you down to Arthur Avenue in the Bronx. We're going to stop at Mario's on Arthur Avenue in the Bronx. We're, we're going to go to Rigoletto. Sauce. We're going to get some We're going to get sauce. We're going to get gravy. We're going to get prosciutto. <laughs> we're going to get everything. A little calamari. Vida, vida. I'm parched. Yes, fly her in. We should do that. Lenore. What's up, Lenore Cataraza? We should fly her in. Shout out to Lenore. She's such a Hi, sweetheart. Lenore. Friends okay. with. We, or we could go there. Huh? With Rosemary G. Marino McMahon, we my go friend. To Ohio. Oh, that's nice. They have a lot of um, carnivals there. I've never been to Ohio. I think so. I've been no? to Ohio. Road right. trip to Ohio. Vinny Spano's in the building. What's up, Vin? What's up, Vinny? What's going on, my brother? Abel, I love you too. All right, so here well, we go. So is it sauce all right, Lenny, or gravy? Let's shut it, Lenny. Shut it. Okay. Let's go on to the next thing. All right, so we're in. now, thanks to Lenny, I have to go out and buy Oreos tonight. He uh, always does this to me. The last time was the chocolate cake. And all I could think about the whole show was chocolate cake. Now I'm thinking about Oreos and milk and dunking. She has to buy Oreos because next week we're going to have an Oreo right, dunking I'm gonna contest. Practice. And we're going to find out exactly how long it takes for an Oreo to be dumped in lactate milk on my end and regular milk on hers and to fall apart. I think six seconds. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand. You agree five, with me? Six. How many seconds do you think? Wait a minute. I said six seconds. I say six. six uh, no, I say seven because seven is God's number. Okay. Seven is seven God's is number. Seven is the lucky number. All right. But here's the bad, here's the worst problem. I do not have any food. <laughs> In my refrigerator. You know why? So you're too funny. Know why? I'm gonna tell you Don't why. Just said it's time for you to start hold thinking. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. The reason why I have food in my refrigerator is because I eat everything. Because he makes me so, bring him food every day. So she just said. Because <laughs> he makes me bring him. So food. she just said. So she just but, said about the Oreos and the milk. Yes, you know, get yes. it. Well, these cupcakes are so delicious. There's been six cupcakes in my refrigerator. I've already right? six, yeah. Okay, there's two left. Okay. And guess who's eating them? Me! All right, you eat those. I got you. No, I'm saying at the end... I can go home and whip up some brownies. At though. the end of the... I can whip some brownies. <laughs> at the end of the... It's 8.15. Okay. Time for Lenny to say good night. Okay, let's go. All right, so here we Next go. Next subject. Next subject. Oh, yes. you're going to like this one, Anonymous. Joe. Anonymous. And April. Our anonymous email... 
Wow. We get every week. We get an anonymous email from yep. one of our rock star listeners and viewers it's that a- they want us to help with a problem that they have. Get in our advice, your advice, and we got a very interesting one. So week. everybody, we're gonna get a little risque. This is a little risque. This and is an and email. listen, and I know Lenny's gonna make me read it. And and <laughs> yes, definitely, because it's better. At, it's better at your mouth. All right, all right. Okay, so. Parental advisory suggested. suggested. We are a we are an adult show, strip live raw radio interactive talk show, starring Lenny Lucia. We are absolutely a adult show. Yes. Okay. I don't think anybody young is watching. Well, we just you know I do have some minors on my Facebook. Oh. Okay. You know. Yeah. So so. I just want you guys. Well, not minors. To put that. No. Well, you know, not. 21. You know what I'm saying? So to me. Oh, okay. So, okay. so anyway. Um, it's not that bad. All right, go ahead. It's babe. really not that yeah, bad. Yeah, do it. All right, this one comes from a woman who has been in a relationship dating this man for. They can hear me. I'm but, like, yes, you can. But talk a little louder. Talk louder? Yes, there you go. I don't think they need me to talk louder. <laughs> um, she's been dating this I man. I love what she's doing. Almost... Push back. I love it. Love this girl. It's almost a year. Love this girl. I'm trying to talk over talk. here. They've been dating almost a year, and the boyfriend wants to spice things up, and he has asked her if she would consider involving another person, like a threesome. Another person? What do you mean? A threesome. So who's... He wants her to have a, a threesome. A threesome. What am I saying wrong? That's correct. A threesome. So hold on. So it's the... The it's girl... The girl. Is dating this man. God, for how long? Almost a year. She got the email. I didn't get it. And he wants a threesome with her because he okay. wants to spice it up. And she is like, oh, no way. I've never done that. I don't want to do that. Absolutely not. So now he has said... He kind of like let it go. Yeah, but now no. it's like stuck in her head and she feels like... That he really wants her to do this, and they're ba- they're in love. They're both in love. Mm-hmm. So now her question to us was, should I do it? Because I really don't want to, but I don't want to lose him. Oh, wow. And I want to do it for him because I love him, so what should I do? Wow. What do you think, Lenny? Let me see. What? How long are they together? What kind of... And people are you. It's the holidays and you talk like this. <laughs> oh, you're so Becky, funny. no negative, never. Um, how long? Whoa, whoa, whoa I have to. I, I have I, to know. Wait, how long are they dating? I told you, almost a year. A year, okay. okay. And it's her writing in. No, she's writing in because the boyfriend wants her to do it. And it's after a year, and they're in love with each other. Yes, they're both in love. Wow. But she's totally against it. She's never done anything like that. Okay. She doesn't want to do it. But now, like, she feels like he, he stopped talking about it and he said, yeah, it's okay. But she thinks it's still in his head, and now she's just worried that, like, if she doesn't do it, you know, maybe she should do it because she loves him. So you know what I say? Good. I'd, de- I'd love to know what you I say. I say that if he really loves her, mm-hmm. he wouldn't make her do something that she doesn't want to do. Or feel comfortable with. True, hundred percent. That he should respect her feelings yes. and shouldn't have even brought it up because he obviously knows that she was against it. So why even bring it up? You know, if you love her, let it go, and you shouldn't have even really said it. I think it has a lot to do with. You know what? I don't think she's telling you about story? his past. Yeah. So he probably has been one risk- year and he's bored already yeah i know rebecca that's not good that's right good okay right yeah cha-cha joe very that's good okay he's a sick man <laughs> <that needs help. laughs> so. but don't compromise your self-worth yes april exactly yes talk about it but don't compromise your own self becky no exactly. negative never okay yes, yes. everybody share it Juicy. In my opinion, if he really loved her, he wouldn't want to be with anyone else. Mm, yes, Dawn, I agree. You know I what's, agree. But you know Why what? Why does he need to But you want to hear what the new norm is? There are other ways to The new norm up. is to have a threesome before you're 40. 
It's okay. out. It's well, out I didn't there. know how old they are. It's out there. It's there. crazy. She didn't say anything? No. How old is she? Well, he should have had the threesome before. He probably did. And he's used right, he's, he's probably used, used to it. it. Yeah, but if he loves her, he has oh, to. Oh, I done. wanna talk to him. Oh my god. Wait, wait, where is Lenny? But what I'm saying is, what's his past? She's not telling you. You have to when you get these emails, babe, you gotta find out the, the guts of it. They email what they want me to know, Lenny. Maybe they don't want to tell me everything. Or maybe she doesn't know. Why don't you just email her back and say, How long have you been together? I take the A email year, and then and, I and what's it on his pet but what's his past? Sometimes you email back, they don't email you right away. Yeah, but I wanna know what's his past. Because to me probably his past is probably well, prior. Let's just let's just say he's a man. I'm sure he's had a threesome. Well, what the hell is that bastard doing anything? <laughs> Whoa, wait a second. What are you bashing us for? I'm not bad. Why is that bad? I'm bashing you. What are you trying to You're looking at me like, he, had, well, he probably had a threesome. <laughs> uh, what is that doing with me? <laughs> Jesus, criminals. <laughs> he, <laughs> stop. Joe said it's the new norm. <laughs> it's the I think he's craving. Oh, my God, I'm cracking up. Yeah, because it's you. Look, she's turning around. It's, it's, you know what it is? It's this damn champagne. It's the Corbell. Guys, it's the Corbell. It's the Corbell. Rosa, what's up, Rosa? I'm joking. Okay, Rosalie's daughter is on right now. See what I'm saying? Hey, you're making me. You're making he needs me to do what so makes him happy with someone ready. who wants to do it. Okay. Exactly, Becky. She's such an intelligent woman. <laughs> But I'm gonna tell you. But I'm gonna tell hey, you. Hey, Joe's. What? That's too funny, Joe. You're too funny. I don't want to start trouble, but it sounds like Lenny sent you the email. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. No, maybe. she. Listen. April said maybe they can compromise. I'm gonna okay. tell you. Wait, whoa, 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 April. What is that compromise? Yeah, there's no. I'm, whoa, whoa, wait, I'm, wait, wait. What is that compromise? <laughs> <laughs> what half of the half, yeah. two, two some. <laughs> two some. How do you split a threesome in half? It's one and a half. I guess one guy, a guy on one boob and the and the girl on the other. You can't. How the hell are you compromised for that? Oh my god, I got the giggles now. All right, so. I got the. What do I say you, as so. a man? What do I say? You know what? He needs to do what makes him happy. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you what it's him. like. You ready? I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a really. Awesome analogy. I'm mean, like G2 right now. Okay, here okay? we go. Okay. It's like a man a asking a woman to get a brush job. It's not the same, Lynn. Hold on, hold on. Now, the woman is doing it for the man. She really doesn't want to do it. Mm. But, so now, this is the same thing. That's interesting, but... It's the same thing. I failed to see how that's the same. It's the same in the sense of... You you don't want to do something, but you're gonna do it for, it for you. yes. But if you it's love on somebody, that magnet, it's it's but, up but there. No, it's on but that level. If you love somebody, level. you wouldn't ask them to do something that you know they. Feel but what I'm saying with. is this: the same thing. If you get breast, right? If you get bigger breasts, yeah, but I don't believe fake, in that. Hold I on, hold on. Hear me out. Hear me out. Okay. If if you get Fair breast, enough. guess what? It's all the man. It's all to please no, him. No, hold on, no. It's no. all to please him. I don't think so. I think women. If do you're wait, if you're, I'm asking you, right. Lucia, okay, all right. Lucia, okay. <laughs> Are you yelling would at you me? Would you like to get breast? I want you to get breast. You know what? It turns me on. Yeah. Can you get breast? Right. Now you're doing it for me, right? Okay. But because why are you wait, wait, wait. No, I'm not yelling. <laughs> Babe, so listen. Out. And and it's you know it's a fake thing. Okay. It's fake. I'm used to fake, right? All my girlfriends were fake as mm -hmm. far as boobs and, you know. And but what does that have to do with the I, threesome? The threesome is you're not doing it for yourself. You're doing it for him. So, therefore, you exactly. just. Exactly. So, that's what but I'm you, saying. That's my point. You have to do something so, for yourself. Yes. So, what I'm saying is you're Let doing the threesome for him and then you're getting your breast for him. So, it's all about him. It's not about you. It's no longer about you. You, okay. guys, you guys get it, right? Um. Okay. Let's see what April says. Oh, said. so the Becky, hold on. would what? be that maybe she would be comfortable doing something little, but enough to fulfill his fantasy. Okay, okay that's, that's good, April. You're always very intelligent. With another you? guy or another woman. Hmm. Look, look. What? 
Oh, I have my, I don't have that. Yep, just came up. What's up? What's up, Fatima? Oh, and I said with another guy or another woman. Becky, very interesting. Very interesting. Because uh, some guys it's with an, are wants, turned on by that, and some no, girls no, are No, it was with another woman. He okay. Said another woman. Oh, man, I almost, Sorry, let, I almost let the cat out of the bag. Oh, Lord, help me. What are you doing now, Len? No, I almost let the cat out of the bag. You're in trouble. Well, listen, I had a girlfriend that was... You're skating on thin ice, Lenny. <laughs> a girlfriend that was bisexual, and she liked girls. And she, you know... All right. So, All right, and she, know about she your would, No, it's not sexcapades. She would, we don't want to know about your sex She would, <laughs> she would be turned on for us to be with women. All so. right, Lenny. All right. No. I actually said that on Facebook a lot. Yes, Jesus Christmas. Okay. Cheers. Right, <laughs> Let it go, Letty oh, Joe Pastor. Oh God, here he goes. I'm I'm late for All the right. I'm late for the door right now. Tommy Lennon, what's up, Tommy Lennon? All right. Guys, Smart move yes. moving is in the house. Guys typically do want another woman, that's true. Although I didn't know this guy that said Becky. that it could be either or. Really? I did have, I had one of my guy friends tell me a story and he wanted his girlfriend to do the same thing and she said, no, I don't like women. He said, all right, let's do try another guy. <laughs> like he just wanted to do it. So he's like, guy, girl, I don't care. No, it is too. I think it's a challenge also. You know, I think it's, I think it's a guy getting his way or a girl getting her way, you know? Yeah. Because, because, you know. said put a lid on it. No shit, Lenny. I'm Put a lid on it. I'm here and going to eat Oreos. <laughs> Patty McLaughlin, what's up, Pat? All right, all right. Pat's in the house. I think it's up, time Pat? for the... Oh, you think that was bad? Ready for the okay. riddle? Oh, the riddle's pretty bad. This nope, is it's like about the sex. This is one of our juiciest shows. I Very, think. yeah. This, we got, Everything is juicy. Well, because today. you're you. You want to get juicy. That wasn't me. I didn't get that email. You want to get juicy. I didn't write the email. You didn't write the email, but you got it, and you were like, babe, babe, babe. I'm like, what? Like oh, wait to hear this. Like that, Lenny. You didn't say wait to hear this you one. You can't mimic me. Because <laughs> I talk. <laughs> All right. She let me tell you something. She just got spray tan. If she didn't get spray tan, you would see her red. <laughs> no, I wouldn't. As, as close. I don't get red. As, oh really? I don't blush, Lenny. April said you were so red. Forget about it. No, I wasn't. Hey, Lenny Lucci, you see Pat? I wasn't. I'm in love with a man. I couldn't have sex with another man. If I'm in love with a man, I couldn't have sex with a mother. I man. wasn't red, Lenny. I was laughing so a hard. A foursome. Oh, Joe says orgy. First of all, Lenny, let me clarify. When I laugh that hard and uh, get the giggles, uh, I get red because I'm, like, really laughing. And I'm getting into... I was. I had the giggles before. So I was, okay, like, everybody. really laughing hard. All right, everybody. Anyway. This is... I agree with that. If I'm in love with a man... Yes. Because I am my my sign is a Scorpio, and being a Scorpio, I am one of the most loyal people. Oh. I am loyal to the ends of That's time. Right. If if you're my friend, forget it. They're my friend, my boyfriend, my family. No. There's nothing I wouldn't do for you. Like I would, I'm so loyal. So if I'm in love, Grace with somebody, Marie, what's up? I'm what's up, Steph? Good, yeah, baby, good. If I'm in love, yeah, and it's my guy, yeah, I. I wouldn't. I so, wouldn't want to be with anybody else. So I know, and so, I'm a little jealous. So I wouldn't. I wouldn't be able to. Oh, do I that. love. See, I love that. What? I love that you own that. I am. I'm I, a always, jealous, I always. So I always say own share. it. I couldn't share. I love that. I couldn't share my guy. I love with that. Somebody else. I can't. See, but I, I love when a woman or a man, whoever it is, own it. I always say you could always be, be yourself, and, and feel. Whatever way you want to feel, a man or woman, but own it, and you own it. And yeah, so I, I have really right. awesome news for everybody. Um, More news? Yes, yeah, good news. What news? We're gonna go to Masiello and Sons Jewelers. Oh, no, we're not, Lenny. Come on. And stop. we're gonna check out some uh, some rings. Lenny. Yeah, for the future. No, we're not. Let's see. That's yeah. coming up in the future. Yeah, hey, come in the future. All I just right. want to see what you like. Look <laughs> in the future. Isn't that nice. All right, nice. Lenny. Can you look at me? All right, Lenny. Oh, look how. Cute, <laughs> it was the cannoli proposal on our show. What show was that? Show three? Uh, no, show five. Show so, five. that's pretty cool stuff, right? Reba, you I can't hear us? Yeah, I don't share. 
No sharing. All right, no sharing. Okay. Just sharing on what? No canola. Just sharing strip line rates. That's hot. But no sharing. We're gonna get our studio. Everybody, please like and share this way. uh, All right, so here we go, um, everybody. We went with the anonymous. Now, riddle of the week. The riddle of of the the week. week. Joe Pastore is not getting this one this week. (laughs) (laughs) It's the riddle of the week. April will definitely look. She April said, "Wow." Probably get it. Tommy Schmidt, okay. give me two Oreos and put me to bed. I'm a one woman man. Oh, Tommy, you're good. You, Tommy. God bless, I love Tommy. That. Listen, I'm nice. gonna tell you straight out. It took me a long time to get here, and I'm here. And where are you? And you know where <laughs> no, I'm I'm, you, know, you know where I am. And I love my I'm girlfriend. I love my girlfriend. Put your glass. Oh, sorry. I love my girlfriend. And I love what we have. Yes. And this is awesome. I don't need anybody else. Is there a cannoli? I don't need another woman. I don't need anybody else. Hold on. Is there a cannoli? No, no. (laughs) I'm just kidding. Really? I got jokes. Oh, my back, my back. Oh, my back. Oh, my back. (laughs) So, in the future, guys, you're going to witness something really awesome. No, not on Facebook Live. She's never going to. You're not doing that on Facebook Live. Listen to what I tell you. I'm not. It will be, everybody will know about it. But it's That's not going to be online. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Lenny. I'm going to pay somebody. I'm going to pay somebody. I'm going to do my job. That's a private do- moment. Why? They're part of our life. When, I, when, you, when you signed up for this, I told you. <laughs> when you signed up for this, you Lenny. signed up for the whole damn thing. All right. All right? Let's get on to the riddle. Here we go. I got these bitches. I got the riddle. Let's go. Here we go. The riddle of the week. The riddle of the the week. The riddle of the week. It It sounds so sweet. sweet. It's it's the riddle of the the week. week. I like that, babe. That's good. (laughs) All right. I know Lenny's going to make me read this. Oh, my God. Look what Joe wrote. Sick bastard he is. He's a sick bastard. Because divorce Yeah, No, this one. <laughs> Which one? Oh, this sick bastard. What is he? Oh, no, no. <laughs> okay, great. ready? The riddle. Here we go. Listen up, you guys. Ready? I'm probably going to get this okay. one. Okay. Okay. Ready. You play with me at night yep. before you go to sleep. Yes. You can't get caught fiddling with me at work. No can oh. stuff. I just went like that. I put my hands on the table. All right. They're going to get it. They're so no, freaking they're smart. No, they're they not. I only allow a few select people to touch me. What am I? Say it again. Okay. You you can play with you play with me at night before you go to sleep. Yep. You can't. And I say can't. Get caught fiddling with me at work. Mhm. And I only allow a select few to touch me. What am I? What am look, I? Look, look, look. Oh, my God. Yep. Becky oh, and Fatima we, and oh Joe. Oh, my God. Girls, you, you got, got it. it. Wait, Joe said boobs. <laughs> no, Joe got it afterwards. So we're going to give it to oh, Becky it and Fatima. Yeah. Becky Fatima. Wait a minute, Tommy, what happened? Becky Fatima, I told you. I told you. That Our rock fast. star listeners and that viewers are very, the very smart. Is phone. phone. That's it. Cell phone. So, Becky very and Fatima, smart. email us. Hey, Tommy. <laughs> email us. Let us know your size. We have a small, medium. We're going to send a shirt out to you. Tommy, we're sending you a shirt anyway. Don't worry. Well, we have to make sure. A strip shirt. A penis. You wrote penis. Yeah. Come on, babe. I told you it was very easy. I told you that. And we're on 835. Yes. Don't forget, once again, this Friday, coming to you live, Aura, DJ Derek Florin, coming up after this is Monday Madness with DJ Derek Florin. Okay, Joe wants to send him a shirt for Sue, so she's a small. Okay, oh, definitely, it. definitely. Without a doubt. Small, got it, Fatima. Okay, Fatima, send us your address so we can send it. Rebecca, just private message one of us. Yes, Becky, that's it. Becky and Fatima, definitely, and Sue. That's it. Okay. Send one to Sue. Because we have to to order more, and they're going to be stripped live. We can just drop it off to you because you're local. Well, we're going to have Joe and Sue here. 
We would love to, you know what? We're going to incorporate. We're going to have two chairs. Yeah, us, Larry, yeah, yes, we'll do that. Be fun. Yeah, that'd be cool. That'd be hysterical. Tommy Spoon said, I suck at this game. I, I just broke all my furniture. Tommy, I said I'm sending you a shirt when we get our strip. All right, everybody, keep on sharing. All right, so. My favorite part of the night. Yeah, this is, this is pretty cool. I love this segment. We just added it last week, and it was a big hit. Yeah. It was. This segment is called Things That Make You Go. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. And this one is good because it's a it's a quiz. Yeah. So it's, it's multiple choice. I like Maybe. to stimulate your mind a little bit. Yeah. You know? Even so, though... So, Tommy, you can get this. Come on. You All can right. win this. This is our new segment. So it's multiple choice. So I'm going to give you three, three scenarios. Mm -hmm. And one of them is false. And you have to... Pick the one that is false. So it's going to be A, B, or C. Okay. Things that make you go. And there's no pr and there's no prize for this. Except for Tom. We would be <laughs> we would be freaking broke if we gave prize for everything. So okay. Dawn Jennings, how are you? Beverly Hello, Wilson, Dawn, we love you, Dawn. You? What's going on, Beverly? How are you? We have a new anyway, listener. Well, that's up to Lenny. I keep showing him the thing for the shirts. What? Oh, we have our logo now, so now we can make the shirts. Yeah, yeah, very shortly. Yes, yes. We I can't, just got our I logo can't, done like a week I ago. I can't right? wait to eat this like you wouldn't believe. And my penny. What are you, a penny on the vodka? No, it's a just a penny. Ooh, nice penny right, with, right. with uh, so, money now. Nice. Love you too, Dawn. Thank you. Dawn, um, you're the best. Look, yeah, we look just at we, Vita. She said be already. Reem, what's up, Reem? We just got our... Kim, uh, what's up, Kim? our logo finalized, like a week or two ago? Uh, Probably about two weeks ago. Yeah, we just yeah. got it like finalized and done, so now we can make our shirts. So everybody share. We want everybody share. Okay, here we, we go. We love you guys. Things we thank you so much. that make you go, hmm. Mm. Okay, ready? A, flamingos turn pink when they eat shrimp. That's A, flamingos turn pink pink when they eat shrimp. B, fish have eyelids. Ready? Yep. And C, hard liquor spoils. Which one of those three is false? This is our new segment, Things That Make You Go. Yep. Hmm. A, B. Hmm. Things That Make You Go. Hmm. Hmm. I thought we just decided we were not sharing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, thank you, Reems. Oh, nice. Oh, Reems thank the you best. Thank you so much. You're sweetheart. Um, love you too, Kim. What's up, Kim? Okay, Fatima said A. No. <laughs> <laughs> Which one is false? I saw things A, that may go on. B or C. Flamingos turn pink from eating shrimp, A. Yes. Fish have eyelids, B. C, hard Liquor ding, 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 spoils. Ding. We have a winner, Rebecca. Becky. The answer is C. There you go, Becky. Hard liquor does not spoil. There you go. You can keep That's it forever four. in your freezer. That's it. <laughs> or Good job, Becky. Good you job. go, girl. Good job. She's from the Bronx, too. Bronx in yep. the house. Bronx is in the house. That's Very it. intelligent. Boogie down, Bronx. Boogie down, okay. Bronx. Okay, our second part. Mm -hmm. A, B, C. Mm hmm which one is false? A, B, or C? Ready? Let's Here see. we go. Cats have over a hundred vocal cords. Wow. Okay. Ready? A snail breathes through its foot. Wow. And C, the Mona Lisa has eyebrows. Huh. A, Interesting. Cats have over a hundred vocal cords. Wait, they have ten seconds for this because they, they can go to Google. A snail breeze through its foot. And see, the Mona Lisa has eyes. Alright, so here we go. Ten. Google. Ten, nine, eight, eight seven, six, six five, five, four, three, three two, two, one. Joe Pest story. The answer is C. The Mona Lisa does not have, have eyebrows. eyebrows. Very good, Joe. So ladies you and gentlemen. Googled that. We are really 20 minutes early, which That's is okay. great. That's okay. That's awesome. Finish early because I got to get Oreos. <laughs> <laughs> I got to go to the store. So, so I, I I knew the riddle, they would get that fast. Well, we could do the L&L speed round if you want. Um, nah. Nah. Okay, go ahead. I just don't, you know what? Let's stick with two, you know. 
Okay. So here, so no, here's we'll the, so here's the thing. Early. No, we don't, have, we don't have to end early. We don't. Lenny, you gonna talk what, in twenty minutes? No. <laughs> <laughs> what it's about? You, you're gonna laugh, guys. But we have, we want to actually show you guys. I think it's pretty cool for us to show you. What? Uh, our board. Why do we have to show the board? I think it's cool. Why? Because we always look over and we just want to give like them. To show everything. Well, right? we want to give them a little, you know, inside on on our show. You know what I'm saying? So. We'll give them a little inside, and for the next five or ten minutes, we're going to, well, about a couple of minutes, we'll show them what we look at and basically how we write it out. And um, All right. I think it'll be pretty cool. Lenny wants to show the board, but I'm taking a strawberry. Okay, and I'm going to have a cupcake because I'm starving right now. All right, I'm showing so, No, board. no, not yet, not yet. Oh. Sit down. Sit down. So, at first, we want to thank everybody. You can't eat a cupcake. Yeah, babe. We thank everybody again. We could just end early because we never end early. You don't give us time for what? Derek to go on. Yeah, well, we got fifteen minutes. We like got fifteen over. minutes. It'll probably take me fifteen minutes. Oh, but. here we go. Lenny's gonna say goodbye. All right, so I'm gonna eat a cupcake. Everybody, on air. get your stopwatch ready. This is a red. That's amazing dress, Lucia. Oh, thank Joe, you. you're the best. Thank you, Joe. Joe, we're gonna have you and. And Sue. On our show. On our show. And, you guys gotta come on the and show. Sue's gonna wear her small Zazari.com yes. t shirt. Okay, on air. And we're gonna have a blast. We're gonna have a blast. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'll tell you what, we're gonna cook here. We'll have a nice dinner afterwards. It'll be really cool. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. You guys come on the show. You guys are really awesome. Yes, we love you guys. We love all of you guys. We mm. wish all of you would oh my come God, over. Baby, I couldn't wait. Oh my God, it's so good. Lenny has to eat the cupcake. <laughs> we'll be there. April. Right? April, we need to get April. you here. April, we are. We're doing a GoFundMe. We're doing a GoFundMe <laughs> for you, <laughs> April. We'll fly April in from Ohio to be a guest. Oh and see New York. We'll take her around. <laughs> We're pasta and To so all the places. Pasta <laughs> You're so funny. Mm. Thank mm. you, Rebecca. Thank you. Thank you, your mother. No, I'm saying my Thank dress. you to your mother because she's so Oh, my God. So, Lenny can't talk now, so oh. <laughs> I'm in charge. <laughs> mm, so good. Welcome to the Lucia show now. <laughs> this Lenny's going to talk. Mm, and on so. tonight's episode, <laughs> Lenny is speechless. And Lucia has to do the last 15 minutes by herself. <laughs> Anyway, so talk about so Friday and Saturday. I just want to recap what Lenny's eating. That Friday night, Derek Florin is going to be at Aura. That's right, Hempstead and Turnpike. And he's having a really big party out there, Aura in Long Island on Hempstead Turnpike. Mm -hmm. Is that right? Mm -hmm. And uh, he's having uh, guest DJs there with him. DJ Michelle Francesco's in the house. Oh, Michelle, we're gonna blast out, and we blast it out. My um, Brooklyn party. Okay, so yeah, so Friday. You guys Friday. should go to Aura Friday. That's gonna be an awesome time if you're in the area, or even if you're not in the area. Love you, Michelle. Yeah. And Saturday, my Brooklyn brand block party in Brooklyn. That's with right. Vincent Pastore's birthday. Birthday bash, celebration. That's birthday right. Birthday celebration. That's right. And Willie DeMeo. That's it. And Chris DeMeo. Oh. My Brooklyn brand. And, and Michelle. Jesus. And Michelle, Michelle Francesco's entertainment. entertainment. She just and checked G2 in. That's right. Love you. Our, our good no. friend G2. She and just checked in. Gina Marie will be there. Mm -hmm. MCG2. I just said that. DJ MCG. Ross the Boss. DJ Ross the Boss. Zazrio.com will be. Zazrio.com will be in the house. Lucia will be in the house from Strip Live World Radio Interactive Talk Show. Sorry, then Lucia. I will. <laughs> I don't know. I might have. What's up, Lyle? What's have, going on? I might have other engagements that night. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's called getting I, your ass to. I might be signing autographs somewhere. <laughs> I might be doing a book signing. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, so. That's going to be a great time. Lenny, you're oh, doing cupcakes. Hold on. <laughs> oh my God, babe. Really? I'm spitting freaking. He's spitting on. I'm sorry, princess. That's but okay. it's old school Brooklyn. Block party. Brooklyn style block party. It's going to be awesome. Shout out Michelle. 
Michelle off the hook. We the love hook. you, Michelle. That's Nick gonna be Francesco. Like old school. Like when I grew up in the Bronx, we always had black parties. That's right. So much fun. And Vinny's from the Bronx. So we have the Bronx going to Brooklyn. What part of the Bronx is he from? I'm curious. I, don't, I think maybe off the Avenue, Pelham Bay. Oh, cool, cool. So, yeah, you'll be able to meet him. We'll take a lot of pictures. Vinny's okay. a great guy. He's good friends with Michelle Francesco's and Willie DeMeo. Always remember mybrooklynbrands.com. Chris DeMeo's brand new. Awesome Attire Company, M-E-T-A-N-O-I-A, attire.com. God and Faith, awesome stuff. Check out his, okay? All right, Tom. Wise, hold on. Wiseguywear.com, wisegirlwear.com, Michelle Francesco's Entertainment Agency. Michael Lewis, Anthony Asante, Nick Del Rey, Jersey Jerry, Peter Gordio, Pamela Roth, Joanne Bichetta, MCD2, DJ Ross the Boss, all of our beautiful friends are going to be in the house in Brooklyn on Saturday. You guys got to come out. It's going to be old school. And DJ Chaz, and I guess his, his, um, his wife Joanne and his sister, Donna, they're going to have their trucks, the food trucks there. Okay, so we have cool. sausage, peppers, Zeppelis. Right, Michelle? Oh, it's on, Lenny. Lenny just Oh, look on. at Michelle, shout out. We love you, Michelle. Bronx the best. To Brooklyn. Word. Oh, oh on, so psyched. Yeah. Angelo. Right, wait, I want to read this. Tommy, Angelo. Tommy Smooth said, Talk. great job, guys. Thanks for the support. Always. All the time. I'm in shock right getting Oreos and sweet fish. <laughs> ben and Jerry's Chubby that's right. Hubby. Ooh, that's a good one. I love Ben and oh. Jerry's. Ben and Jerry's Chunky Monkey. I'll be at ShopRite in about 10 minutes. <laughs> if Len, well, with Lenny, it might take me half an hour because he's not going to stop talking. No, we we have to make love. Are you kidding me at our show? Oh, no. Things get hot. <laughs> sorry, because things get really hot. I'm, I'm not going to apologize for that. I'm sorry. Oh, Lenny, come on. Nah, I, listen, I'll tell you I'm right now. I'm out of here. I'm getting Oreos. Margaret, what's up, Margaret? But let me tell you something. You guys, night, Lenny. Saturday night is going to be great weather, and I can't Take wait. Night. I'm talking, babe. Say goodnight, Lenny. No, I'm not going to say goodnight. You got yet. five minutes. I'm really excited yeah, about Saturday. I'm, I'm really excited about Saturday. <laughs> Eat your freaking hair. Wait Stuff a, a couple of strawberries you in your mouth. My glass? I didn't take your glass. I put it Lenny? so it's so it's nice. It Symmetrical. looks good. <laughs> Symmetrical. I just had one cupcake that I spit all over you. I know. Stop <laughs> taking my glass. So, oh, Sean, how good is Chunky Monkey? Bunny Bracken, how are you? So, everybody, come out on Saturday. MyBrooklynBrand.com. Block party. Old school. It's going to be unbelievable. It's brought to you by Willie DeMeo, okay, and Michelle Francesco's Entertainment Agency. And I told you, okay. DJ Ross, the boss, will be in the house. MCG, too. Lucia and I will be in the house. Zazaria.com will be in the house. We're ecstatic. It's going to be a lot of fun. If you're Come lucky. out and join us. Um, if you're and, lucky, uh, Lenny, I'll make an appearance. <laughs> you know what? Remember what when, when, remember when, uh, Ralph did in Honeymoons to Alice? Bang, zoom, go to the moon. <laughs> you're going to the moon. You're going to the moon, Lucia. You're going to the moon. Lenny. <laughs> Bridget. What's up, Bridget? Tiffany, what's up? Say a quick goodbye for once in your life. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll see you, so we'll see, a little bit of, we'll see you guys Saturday. Yes. It's going to be a lot of fun. We'll see you guys. Yeah. Well, we'll see you, all of you guys next Monday. Yeah. And next we'll, Monday, definitely, but Saturday. Live more radio talk, interactive talk show. Starring. Lenny. And Lucia. That's it. Go with the flow. Anything, Anything goes. goes. All right, so we want to thank everybody, as always. Yes, thank you, guys. What an awesome show. We love you. We are looking for a studio. We can't wait to get our studio. Yes. We're going to have a live studio audience. We're going to have guests. Uh, we're going to have a lot of celebrities. Hopefully, we can get Sue Ooh. and Joe to come we next week. We are definitely getting Sue that and Joe. That would be nice, because yeah. we got to start having guests. Yeah, I think that would be fun. Next week, we're going to have our first two guests. Well, well, ask them first. Yeah, they said yes. Oh, did they say yes? Okay, well, we'll make sure we ask them first. I know, Tiffany. I was Michelle, we love you. Time. Nick, we love you. And if you need an awesome contractor, Nick Francesco's. Look him up. F-R-A-N-T-Z-E-S-K-O-S. Tony Spano. Tony just checked What's in. Up, What's Tony? up, Tony? What's up? 
what's going on? We just had a very cheap glass, oh, no, <laughs> a cheap bottle of Corbell. She loves the Corbell, so. Uh, no, it tastes good. I like things champagne. So next week, guys, it's very important. We're going to be blessing this out. It's very, very important. How long does it take for an Oreo cookie when, <laughs> when dipped into milk, my lactate milk and her regular milk, to break apart? Yes, and next week it's going to be the milk of the week. It's, it's going to be the milk of the, the week. Milk of the week. It's going to be the Oreo, Oreo challenge. The Oreo challenge. It's going to be the week. Oreo challenge Can't next wait. week. So everybody, I want you to go out and buy Oreos. And your milk. All right? Get and your Oreos milk. Oreos and your milk ready. Because from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m., <laughs> all through it, the Oreo we are challenge. going to have a strip live raw radio interactive talk show starring Lenny and Lucia. Oreo, Oreo challenge. challenge. Next week. Okay. And our guest. Very, very important. will be Joe and Sue. Okay. American made contracting. Definitely. Oh, but you know what? If we have Joe and Sue, we got to have wine. That's okay. We'll have, we'll have one, and then we'll have our Oreos. Okay. All right. All right, and everybody. And Oreos. We have drink. 10 minutes. Say goodbye. Okay. You say goodbye. Okay. Tony, I just wanna... love you. Hold on. I, let, let me just say this. Always saying, Hold Tony on, Spano, okay. Eva Marie. All I could say is this. When you guys were, at, were actually in Mastic, and you had your 4th of July celebration, I was there with you guys. And Lucia and I were with you guys. And we were thinking about dad, and I and I had that glass of semi in my hand. I love you guys dearly. You guys Aww. have been family for eight years, and and let me just tell you how I loved your father, and such a beautiful person, uh, such giving people. Your mom as well, your whole family. I'm blessed to know you guys and to be like adopted son. So I just want you to know that. Next year, Lucia and I, well, we're going to be rocking Mastic with you guys and be a part of that picture with you guys because we love you. And uh, we were there with you even though we were in Yonkers, okay? That's what I want to say, so say okay. goodbyes. I just want to say that I appreciate each and every one of you out there that tunes in to watch us every Monday because... Lenny and I love doing the show. It's a dream of both of ours, and we appreciate and love all of you guys, and God bless you all. And I hope everyone out there has love in their heart and finds love if you don't have it. There's, and that's all I have to say. There's so much um, that I'm so appreciative of, and it certainly is my friends and family. Yes. And, of course... One thing more important than anything is meeting my girlfriend four months ago, which is Aww. which is uh, 3-8-2019 <laughs> at a singles event for Events by Tia Maria. Is it 7 7 or? It's 8. Oh. It's 7-8. So, seven, eight. so it's four seven, months. Seven. And uh, I know we have a lot to look forward to. Yes, we do. You are definitely, Only the beginning. You are definitely my partner in crime. You definitely... Uh, <laughs> You definitely calm me down when I need to. It's just uh, the beginning. You you relax me, and uh, and you pump me up too, when we need to be pumped. Excuse right. me, when we need right. When we need to get That's pumped right. up. And uh, you know, doing the parties is just like you know, it's fun. It really is a lot of fun. Yeah. And there's so much that you guys are gonna learn about Lucia that you guys don't know. But one thing <laughs> is for sure. She is such an amazing woman, inside Aww, and out. Thank you. She thank really you. is such a beautiful person, inside thank and out. You. And she, she's a big animal lover, um, and she just loves people, like me. I love everybody <laughs> until you prove to me you're an asshole. True. Th straight out. True. I'll do anything for anybody. I you love. You have a big heart. I have a big yeah, heart. Yeah, it's all that's you know. Why, like, that's why we get along and, yeah. and we're together because we both have like huge hearts yeah. and. We try to help everybody. We try to always do the right thing and be yeah. there for everybody, friends, yeah. family. So, But one thing about this journey and this cannoli journey cannoli of ours journey. <laughs> is really awesome is that we decided to bring you guys on this journey. And you guys are going to go on an amazing roller coaster. <laughs> That's gonna be pretty much Buckle going up. up. It's gonna be a bumpy it's ride. It's gonna be a no. It's gonna be an awesome ride. 
you know, there, there's going to be really some awesome times. And we're so blessed to be able to share them with you guys because yeah. they are so, to me, I told her next Sunday, or pretty much this Sunday, um, I want to start tradition. You know, and we're like, we're talking about, oh my God, Christmas is going to be unbelievable. Wait for Christmas. And then, you know what I mean? Like 4th of July was unbelievable. And that went, you know. Yeah, then Halloween, Halloween, Halloween and her birthday. Yeah. And us going to Graceland. Thanksgiving. You know what's going to be up? And then Thanksgiving and, and then Christmas. Christmas. I love things that that have significance yeah, and family. It's going to be fun. We're Italian. We're all about significance and mm -hmm. family. And we appreciate so much our friends and family. Yes. We really do. That's so okay. we have so much to look forward to. And thank you so much for going on this ride with us. Yes. Really, this is very special. And again, it's, it's something that we really could say that um, it's a dream. And once we get this studio, you're going to be absolutely amazed at what's we're going to bring in and kick it to the next level. And we're going to bring a studio audience. And like I told you, a live studio audience. When I think about that, I think about the Honeymooners with Ralph Cramden and Alice. And how fun. they had that studio live audience. And we're going to have refreshments. We're going to, you know, drink responsibly. Yeah, that's we're going to have, we have wine. Yeah, we're going to have, you know, maybe some, a nice cheese platter or something to that yeah. extent. We're going to have fun. Yeah, because this is what's fun. about, I, listen, if we're going to do something, we've got to do it right. Yes. And we certainly try to. So, everybody, we love you very much. Let's say goodbye. Okay, let's wrap it up. You guys need to hop on that table. <laughs> let's wrap Terry it up. Terry Ann, thank everybody. you so much. Let's wrap it up. Uh, Vita. All Tony right. Spano. April. Frank so. Giambale, my, my old friend, my man, Frank Nick, Giambale. Terry. Nick Francesco. Vita. What's going on, brother? We'll see you, you Saturday. Guys. Thank you so Michelle, much again, Bridget, Tiffany, Margaret. Tommy. I'm gonna just tell you, we're so blessed, and I can't wait to eat the pasta. I'm starving. Okay, we gotta go because I gotta get the Oreos. And it's All three right. minutes to nine. <laughs> Thank we you, everybody. On time. Thank you. And uh, we will see you till next week. We'll see you guys. Hold Monday. on. It's a little <laughs> hot right now, so. Monday. Monday at 7 p.m. But we'll see you guys. you're going to see us over the weekend. We're going to try to make the Friday night Dark Florin in uh, in uh, Hempstead Turnpike, yes. Long Island. I'm sure you'll Aura. see us over the weekend on Facebook Live. Saturday, we're definitely going to make my Brooklyn brand uh, and uh, the block party. That's going to be a lot of fun. Duffy's Azrae.com will be in the house for Vinny Pastor. That's going to be a, that's going to be a lot of fun, babe. And we're going to eat our faces off, so. Okay. And uh, I think that's, that's it. it, right? Ready? Good night, guys. All right, so remember, always. Enjoy your Oreos. <laughs> you can never go wrong by doing the right thing. And from one day to the next, you never know who you're going to meet. And how they're going to change, they're gonna change your life, life forever. forever. It's so crazy that one night could be the rest of your life. A moment. That could fun. be the rest of your A life. A moment can change your life forever. Change your life forever. Really so is awesome. we love you guys. God bless you. God bless Good night Have from good Strip night. Live Raw Radio Interactive Talk Show starring Lenny Lucia. Go with the flow. Anything, anything goes. goes. And we are presented by ZazRadio.com, the ultimate internet smash-up dance radio station and rock star listener experience in the in world. world. Facebook.com backslash ZazRadio, Instagram ZazRadio. We'll see you guys soon. Ciao. Yeah, love you guys.